everybody. Welcome to the D-Pad. I'm Rick. And this is Persona 4 Golden. I'm gonna, I gotta fix the chat real quick while we're while we're doing this. I got a little notification on the way in that like there we go. That should have done it. That uh, our mm. Twitch uh, uh, authorization authentication stuff uh, needs to be refreshed, but it should be all good now. I don't know. Uh, so part of what has us starting so late is uh, I bought an HDMI switcher and I'm a little worried that it actually isn't super compatible with the PS5. I found another one online that is pretty cheap that should do the trick though, so hopefully this won't be an issue. Uh, uh, it won't be an issue next week and onward. Uh, also, part of the reason that I am I am quite so late today is because it's really hard to see in this shot right now, but uh, I assure you that uh, a bunch of boxes have been moved and things. I wonder if I can actually, let's see, can I do, I wonder if I can, if I can show this off on here without the light destroying it. We got shelves over there. We got behind me, yeah, this isn't working at all. This is a terrible idea. Oh, because my hand's on the fucking thing. Let's try this again. Oh my God, it's hard to do this backwards. So, we got a bunch of, yeah, this isn't working, fuck this. Anyway, welcome, welcome, welcome. Uh, when last we left off, we were, fin we had finished up midterms, uh, and we are winding down kind of chapter one of the game. We've got a couple days in-game left to go, and it was going to stretch out a little too much for it was already a too long stream last time. <coughs> so, uh, we're going to be uh, doing a couple more random days worth of stuff before Chapter 2 kind of kicks off. And in addition, we're going to do some uh, Persona Fusions. We put it off last time on the off chance that we got a couple extra social link points. And I think we even did. So, we should be able to start our first uh, uh, backstation trip with, uh, with uh, some Persona Fusion. Uh, what happened plot-wise last stream? I, so the hard part is remembering where the stream before ended. Uh, I think last time was... Because I think we had beaten... Uh, um, now I've forgotten her name. Oh no, I keep forgetting her name. Yukiko. We had beaten Yukiko's shadow in, I think, the previous stream. We started some social links with uh, uh, Dojima and Nanako here at home. Uh, I think we improved one or two other social links as well. Um, Nanako actually also hangs out with the group now and then. Uh, we did midterms. I got myself up to, I think, expert. Actually, where can I see that the best? Uh, do it under social link? No. Can I see it under status? There we go. Yeah, we're up to expert in knowledge, so we're actually doing pretty well there. Uh, I should start working on other stuff besides knowledge at this point. Um, I'll want to swing back around to knowledge in time for, like, finals, whenever that is. But that said, though, social link. Okay, it does look like it still goes up to 10. It Before, it looked, it looked narrow enough that I was actually wondering whether it was only going to 8 this time, but it does look like it's 10. Um, yeah, Yosuke and I are up to 3... Uh, Chie and I are up to three. Yumi Ozawa. Oh, Drama Club, yeah. That's right. I gotta keep I gotta get back into doing now that midterms are over, I should be I should be doing um I should be doing club activities a little bit more. Um But yeah, I think um I think we're about good to jump in. I want to... Oh, that's right. I think I'm going to make lunch. I'm going to skip chatting with Dojima and see if I can get lunch to, to work this time. May have the ingredients make meat stew. So I had to make meat stew. Oh, what did I do last time? Oh, shit. You only have to simmer it. How should you simmer it? For stew? All right, simmer without a lid. Use strong heat. I mean, that'll probably burn. If we're doing a stew... I mean, I think the smart way, if I was making a stew, I would want to simmer with, I, I assume a droplet is one that you just put on, like it doesn't have clamps or something. 
Um, but yeah, you would just you would almost treat it the same way as like a crock pot. You you let it simmer and lightly boil even for a long time, like a nice slow thing to really pull all that stuff out. Exactly, yeah. If you don't have a lid, you run the risk of it bubbling and boiling out. Granted, if you're cranking the heat, you're going to wind up burning it off and uh, blowing it out anyway. But the lid just keeps it from being messy. So I'm going to go simmer with a drop lid. Deliciously cooked to completion. Hey! Long simmered meat stew. Oh, I see. So is that is that essentially a way to make a good healing item? It's kind of fun. Um, let's see. Her persona name is Snow. Hilarious. Uh, dun, 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 dun. Hello, hello to a bunch of folks all coming in there. Strong heat is not simmering. I guess yeah, that's true. Simmering would be more would be more uh, uh, you know slow because you bring it to, bringing something to a simmer is lower than bringing it to a boil. So. Right to lunch today. Do you wish to eat lunch with someone? Oh, okay. Oh boy. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna take Chia to lunch. By which I mean I'm going to eat my delicious lunch in front of her. Eat alone seems like, you know, like a wasted opportunity for maybe. Like I assume the idea here is that you can boost your social link, perhaps. Uh, but Chia also loves meat, so. Let's see how this goes. Ate lunch. Long simmered meat stew. Delicious. Nice. Oh, I don't want to finish it all. What a dilemma. Did you make this for me? Thank you. Aw. Okay, so yeah, so this is a nice this is a nice little social link boost. That's pretty cool. I'm guessing others lets you pick from more folks, right? All right, there were a few quests that I got started that I haven't been keeping a ton of track of either. What is this now? Just for finally over. Oh, the angel statue, yep. Luxurious for the night. Again, sounds kind of like the castle, but it might not be where we're... Someplace luxurious being held by a knight. I'm trying to think if any of the monsters we saw at the castle were referred to as a knight of some kind because maybe it's just like a super rare drop or something um, actually let's whoops wrong thing oh yeah what was oh yeah I wanted to check that at midnight sometimes so I have to uh, uh, I have to make a point of keeping an eye on the time as we get close to midnight quests Girl on the rooftop. That's right. Uh, I think it's not raining right now, so... Oh, yeah, Ritz wire. Practice building first floor. Ritz wire from the TV. All right, well... And I think Friday there's no club activities because it's Monday, Tuesday, Thursday for one, Tuesday, Thursday... Actually, is it Tuesday, Thursday... Friday? Monday, Tuesday, Thursday is drama. Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday. Okay, that was what I thought before, but okay. For uh, for that one. We still got to spend time with Marie. We got to go to the shrine, do stuff there. Yeah, we have a lot of social links up in the air. Let's go to the rooftop. Um, some of these items might not drop if you don't have the quest. That's a good point. That's true. Definitely a good way of scheduling club activities. Yes, yeah, right. <laughs> Let's have... Uh, <coughs> it's a little bit of a bummer that there's so much overlap, but... Funky student. Still the break of dawn. Okay, seems like nothing really there right now. Okay. Hello. Wasn't there one of your classmates who was interested in this girl? Huh, what's the matter? I get the feel, I feel like, I mean, I'm going to ask why she's on the roof, but I wonder if we're supposed to find her three times and ask her all three of these. Feels good, doesn't it? Yeah, okay, that's kind of what I assumed was going to happen. We have to see her on three different days, ask all three questions, and then report back. Uh, okay, so 
I don't know that there's going to be much else that we can do. Let's check the practice building real quick. If there's not much else today, then we can use the opportunity to do stuff in town. I think this is the guy who wants the demon statue. Oh, Ritzwire, yeah. Look some look somewhere with scientific tools. Medieval alchemy lab with like a balance. Okay, so that sounds like okay, that's probably the um I forget what the name of it was, but the fire and water dual elemental like Libra scales looking thing. So that might be something worth going to the castle sometime, especially if I just need to I I if there's time to do some grinding, then I can make a point of grinding in there to try to hit that up. Angel statue is probably also in there. I just have to keep an eye out for something that resembles a knight. Heat balance. Yes, that sounds right. Um, let's start by going... Start here. And kind of wander around a little bit. Biker gangs. Double checking if any of these are like new information or anything. I don't think any of this is new right now. This is probably mostly the, the lull before things kick off for Chapter 2. Like, there's probably not going to be any, like, major... Any, like, major new uh, uh, quests that pop up in the next couple days here. Let's just go to the shopping district. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, let's see, we got a couple options. Oh, Marie. Marie would be a great thing to, to spend time uh, doing today. I don't have a lot of money... The hit Bullied Teacher series. Uh, I think I have... Ju uh, let's not worry about it right now. Diligence and understanding. Sweet. Okay, so those will be good to get with 4K more money. Because I need to buy two more Persona. Persona? Uh, to do fusions. Huh? I've been waiting for you. Hey, why don't you take me somewhere? I don't know the area. You know your way around here, right? Yeah, sure. Oh, actually, yeah, I think we're probably good to, to do this. I was just running through my head of, like, is there somewhere I should go first? But I don't think there's really, like, much right now. It's not raining, so I can't get the the steak croquette or the super croquette or whatever it was. Let's just say yes. Let's, go. Let's do it. A lively place. Oh, no, Juness. Oh, God. Oh, dear. Oh, no. You're dragged here by an excited Marie. Hey. Time sale? Everyone was rushing to grab something called Sa Oh, 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 oh. I guess a time sale, um Oh god. There's a there's a uh, a name for that. I don't know if it's still a thing. But it used to be a thing. Mostly for like supermarkets, though I guess you get it in department stores too. There was a specific name that I remembered it being. Japanese department stores do that. I mean American ones did it? They don't. I, I don't know if they do it anymore, but it used to be a big thing in the eighties and nineties. Um, like, I don't know, it'd be like a spot sale or something. I can't remember the name for it, but essentially, yeah, you'd be shopping and then you'd you'd hear over the the yeah, exactly, yeah, you'd hear over the over the intercom like, oh, special gr great news, shoppers. There's a flash sale basically on. You know, on down pillows for the next 30 minutes. Head on over to aisle 14 and get your pillows now and et cetera, et cetera. Um, can't remember the name for it, though. It's not really a thing much anymore. Uh, actually makes your diligence from en from envelopes go faster. Yeah, I kind of figured that might be the case. Considering the envelopes one sounded like the higher your diligence, the better your job doing it. And it also increases your diligence. So yeah, I'll, I'll make a point of grabbing that and probably reading through it and then starting to finally work on the envelopes. Envelopes, and I always feel like for me, envelopes are for mail. Like the little white ones are envelopes. And then envelopes are the big vertical ones that are for like paperwork and things like at a school. They're usually not for mail exactly. I don't know if there is really a difference between the two. They're probably literally the same thing. But in my mind, envelopes are for mail. Envelopes are for paperwork. I think like Manila envelope is is like just a phrase that's in my head. Blue light specials. That I actually recognize. That might be what I was thinking of. Um, 
Uh, they're just called flash sales. Yeah, on I know that online they're usually referred to as flash sales now. Uh, and also, most of the time, if there's a flash sale advertised, it's actually bullshit, and it's just their usual price that they're making it look like it's a deal, so you so you buy something. But yeah, it is uh, right. There definitely is an actual difference. That's kind of my thought on it. It's just like. I don't know. It's it's not the same as like either and either, where honestly I switch back and forth depending on vibes, but envelope and envelope in my head just have like just they feel different. I don't know. Mm -hmm. Paying for that back in the eighties. Yeah, blue light special sounds exactly right. That sounds like what what I'm thinking of. And the funny part is, I don't think I ever experienced one. At the very least, if I did, I did not know. I was like too young, but I'm just familiar with it through like popular media. Right? Like, I've seen cartoons and, and movies and things where they do that. Ah, Marie's meeting GA. She's so cute. So, like, I'm worried that if I say a friend, she's going to get annoyed because that's too personal. If I say an acquaintance, she might get annoyed that that's too impersonal. If she's... But, I, but honestly, she doesn't seem like she's that... Like, we're that close right now. I might just say this is Marie. I'll do this as Marie. Looks perplexed. Okay, that wasn't a great answer then. I'm Chase Hadanaka. Mm -hmm. Uh-oh. Oh, no. This didn't go well. I know what this is. It shows a lot of stuff. We came to look at the TVs, too? Yeah, I want one, too. We still haven't replaced our old one. Whatever. You're doing great, Marie. Maybe you can turn it to Star Scandals? Was that, like, TMZ? What kind of show? So this feels a little bit... This feels too revelatory in front of Chie, even though it really shouldn't matter. Uh, this feels almost a little too accusatory. This one seems like, you know, a good conversation, you know, continuer there. It's entirely possible that, like, nobody else does envelope envelope the way I do. It is entirely possible. I've just... I don't know if I've ever heard anyone say Manila envelope before. I feel like I've only ever heard Manila Envelope. Not like I hear it all the time now. That's that's pretty, like, I feel like that's only ever a thing that comes up in, like, school and office settings. But um, this makes that available for free order. The entire stock is bought up by bots in five minutes. Yeah, basically. Yeah. Why? Oh, it's like one of those shows, right? The ones where they're all like, blah de blah de blah Everybody watches it. Margaret told me that. Sure. The Marie Margaret naming makes me, like... Almost makes you wonder if she's like a, a disconnected personality from Margaret or something, but. Or she is someone who is dead and is now kind of floating around as a shadow herself or something. All right. Uh -huh. All right. Are you one of those people who doesn't watch TV? That's right. There isn't one in the room. Really? Wow. You must have super strict parents. Yeah, sure. Girl, I don't think I could stand it. Life without kung fu movies? Burr. Gets, I'm j I just get so cold thinking about it. Oh, there's no eclectic Lautwitz. Wow. Holy cow. Electric outlets. Uh, I don't even know what Chia's room looks like. <laughs> like a lot of Marie's social link is just being confused at stuff. Yeah. It it feels like a slightly less cheery Igus situation. I'm going to turn myself down a tiny bit. There we go. I'll tell the nose to install one of those eclectic loutwits. There's nothing to do in there. Oh, my God. Hey, wait, Marie-chan. You don't even have electricity in your room? Uh, hmm. We're at the food court. Everybody getting some steaks and things. Are we having steak and potatoes right now? the steak here in a while, but it really isn't all that bad. You had it a couple weeks ago, Chie. Marie, you haven't eaten at all. You too, Richard. Uh, uh, you gotta eat if you want to grow up big and strong. Just kidding. You eat too fast, you're gonna be fat one day. Oh, Marie. I didn't need to hear that. Oh, I'll get us some drinks. Oolong tea sounds good. I guess it's Oolong tea, right? There's a lot of people at this Juness place. Why? Don't they have anything else to do? If they have TVs, they should be watching them instead of wasting time here. Well. Oh, Mommy, I'm Thursday. I want soda. 
No, you just had one. You'll have to wait. I want it. I want it. I said no. You'll rot your teeth. Is that a promise or a threat? I guess an Elizabeth, but less fun. Yeah, yeah. She's a little bit... She's got some of that, like... Um, she's got a mild amount of, like, that goth girl attitude. Like, on top of the kind of combination of the two of those. It's definitely a double O so sound in Oolong. Or Olong. Olong. Or Oolong. In English, I've always, I've always heard it as Oolong. You think I was ever like that? You don't remember? Yeah, there's a lot I don't remember. Everything. I don't remember anything. I was just walking. I had nowhere to go, and I just ended up in that car. Then Margaret told me to stay there. She also gave me the name Marie. It'd be hard to get around without a name. Must be rough. I don't know. I can't even remember if it was tough. That's okay. It's not like it's troubling me or anything. Lies. Yeah. But I don't know why, but this town is familiar to me. Did you live here before? I mean, she doesn't know. I don't know. The only thing I remember were more like, no, is that this is mine. Oh, a thing. An old bamboo comb in her hand. I had this at the start. This is definitely mine, but so what? This doesn't help anything. Hmm. It ah! We did it. All right, social link number two. Uh, dun, 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 dun. Kimart is still technically in business. With three stores in the Virgin Islands: one in Miami, one in Long Island, one in Guam. Holy cow! Oh, Jesus. Searching for the truth, right? You should stop. There's no such thing. Uh, that's not strictly true. How stupid. Oh, my God. Hey, Chie. Shop was busy, so I just ordered and came back here. They'll bring it to us when it's ready. That's nice. So me or is the mood a bit heavy around here? Don't worry, you two. I ordered for all of us. Oolong tea for everybody. See ya. All righty. Riding their motorcycles, disturbing the peace of a quiet rural town. The biker gang they've been really leaning into. I wonder if that's gonna be a chapter two thing. Our special report took a turn for the violent. Ooh. When one of the apparent leaders attacked the camera crew. Dang, all right. The hell are you punks doing here? Alright, silver haired dude. Is that a school jacket? I think it's literally the same jacket I'm wearing. That voice. Mm -hmm. This ain't a show. Get bent. Still up to the same old tricks. Oh. Do you know him? The Dad? biker gang turns tricks. Uh, no, I don't know him at all. I've never met him. Uh, after, uh, don't worry about it. Uh, well, I know him through work. It's never a good sign. His name's Kanji Tatsumi. He's quite a handful. Kanji. He's been crushing biker gangs in the area since middle school. Is crushing the word they mean? Because crushing sounds like he's beating them up, not joining with them. But I thought he got into a high school and started attending class. Huh. Man, that blur sure is pointless. It's completely obvious who it is. Oh, my God. The guy's family runs a historic textile shop. Oh, that's the shop that's... Okay, I haven't gotten in there yet, but I know the what shop. What happened was he crushed the local bikers all by himself because the noise kept his mother up at night. Okay, so he does beat up on biker gangs. Got it. I wasn't sure if he was part of the biker gang or not. Yeah, this, this makes more sense. It's a nice gesture, but he's way too violent. At this rate, his mother will have to apologize again. Oh, the weather report's showing on the bottom. It's going to rain tomorrow. Okay. I'll make sure to hang the laundry inside the house. All righty. Rain. Boop -a -boop -a Whoa, -ba. it started raining. I guess the weather report was right. Is it frequently wrong? That means the show's probably going to be on tonight. Probably. I hope we don't see anyone. Yeah, that'd be best. 
But if we do, maybe we'll see some kind of clue that can point us toward the killer. Okay, you know. Well, everyone, don't forget to check your TV tonight. Yeah, <laughs> nice. On the Minecraft front, that is. Effectively omniscient for, yeah, yeah. They are always accurate. Got it. <coughs> Be very interesting if, like, a, a few days out, it just sort of randomly picked uh, occasionally the wrong weather until you got closer. It'd be harder from a strategy standpoint, but it'd be interesting. I don't know. Welcome home. That's not what you said. <laughs> don't join a biker gang, Nanako. All right, there's gonna be lots of sun after that. Um, let's save and then head out into the town to see if there's something going on. Oh, actually, no. I basically need to just. I think I just need to check the TV tonight. Yeah. That's fine. The weather system that has inaccurate forecasts. Uh, yeah, no, I can't really think of any. Breath of the Wild, Tears of the Kingdom are only inaccurate if you move to areas with scripted weather, but... Let's see what we got. Oh, no, are we going to save a guy from a biker gang? <laughs> Hard to tell. That almost looks more like Dojima. Okay, never mind. I'm focused. Hard to tell who it is. Could be anybody. Even that guy that suddenly got a lot more attention in the last few minutes. Call Yosuke. Oh, it's you. I was just about to call your cell. So what do you think? That was a guy, wasn't it? It was. I wish I could tell what he looked like. Let's get together and talk more about it tomorrow. All right. We also didn't see anything like happening to him, whereas other ones seem the the previous ones seemed like stuff was going on, you know. Yeah, Teddy slimmed down. He's just looking looking great. He's got a jacket on. We will now hold a meeting on our investigation of the serial kidnapping slash murder case here in Inaba. See now those those bottles just make me want some uh, some green tea, little bottled green teas. Dude, take a breath. <laughs> then does that make this place our special headquarters? Why not? We're holding yes, court exactly. in the food court. Special headquarters. Holding court among the food. Have a nice ring to it. Even showing up on the midnight channel until the <laughs> yeah, right. Uh Anyways, as for what was on last night. Who was that? I saw it too. Might be a case of yeah, uh huh. Person's face, but it was a guy, wasn't it? Presumably, like a high schooler, yeah. So that's how I looked on TV. No, you didn't look like that. That that was a that was a guy. You looked you looked like a girl. Um, different hmm. stuff was happening. Wait a moment. Wasn't really the same. Didn't all the victims have one thing in common? That they were females with ties to the first incident. True. That's so this throws thought. a couple, a bit of that out of the, out of there. Who exactly we saw. In my case, the image on the midnight channel changed after I was kidnapped, right? So keep an eye out for kidnapping. Yeah, the screen got clear all of a sudden, and the program looked like some low-budget TV show. Yeah, we didn't actually see, because for for um, Yukiko, it was like a presentation sort of thing. For think of it, maybe Teddy was right. Mystery Man, we didn't get like a presentational kind of thing there. But last night, we couldn't clearly see whoever it was. Could that mean he isn't inside the TV? I was going to say, we also saw, I mean, I think Yukiko before she was in the TV as well on a previous transmission. Yeah, exactly, yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think mm -hmm. that's safe to assume. If we can figure out who he is, can we prevent him from being taken? Uh, maybe. Yeah. And if all goes well, we might catch the killer in the bargain. It's an awkward use of that phrase, but it works. But to do that, we need to know who the latest Midnight Channel star is. I hate to say it, but I guess we'll <sighs> have to wait another night and see what happens. All right. <clears throat> well... If my deductions are correct, 
Though the image was hard to make out, and we can't say for sure who it was, it was definitely a young male. Great, that just narrows it down to about a quarter of the population of Inaba. But if that's the case, it goes entirely against our prior assumptions. It goes against one of the prior assumptions. It doesn't go against most of the rest of them. Since we cannot identify the person at this time, we have no choice but to wait and see what happens. All right. That's exactly what we just said. Hang on one quick second. I guess we're supposed to be getting a lot of rain uh, in the real world tonight into tomorrow, and I have to figure out if I have to reattach the uh, the um, the uh, the pump stuff. Oh my god, why is this so hard to use? Just show me. Show me precipitation, goddammit. Oh, it's like an inch of rain. I think we'll be fine. There's really not going to be that much tonight. It's going to rain hard for like the next like 20 minutes, and then that's it. I think we'll be good. Shut up! Whoa, Chie! <laughs> Holy cow. Uh, You're so funny, Chie. Holy shit, that was a lot of laughing. My god. Uh, <laughs> oh no! My, my funny bone! <laughs> holy cow. Not again. Oh yeah, I forgot that she has she has like <laughs> she has the nice big long laughing fits. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She loves she loves the goofy shit. This is how Yukiko really is, huh? <laughs> Who'd have thought? By the way, about that guy we saw? I get the feeling I've seen him before. So Yukiko is the Ben of this group. Pretty recently, too. Oh my god, she's still going. Oh, there Dude. we go. Yeah, I've been thinking the same thing since last night. Well, let's check the TV again tonight and think about it more tomorrow. Alrighty. <laughs> oh, never mind, she's back at it. <laughs> crazy hyena? <laughs> That's a good one, Chie. It is? Welcome back. Thank you. Anyway. Eh? Nothing in there. I guess I'm just looking again tonight. We're just zipping right past it. Now I feel double stupid for not just pushing through on the previous one, considering... Oh, I f have I noticed that there, that's a Persona 3 calendar? Because it seems like we're... If anything, really, no. This is, this is a good start for Chapter 2. We kind of like... The day that I jumped in on it was the day where we started getting info. Oh, they're extremely charming. Oh, here we go. It's fighting somebody. We totally have. Still not a presentation, though, so we should still be safe. Did you see that? Yep. Sure, why not? Yeah, I think so, too. Okay. I knew I saw him somewhere. He was on TV. He was on that special news report. Yes, but also, I feel like neither of you saw enough to really... How does he know that that's... Anyway, it doesn't matter. All right. So we finally have a lead. Let's all get together tomorrow, okay? Oh, I almost forgot. It's kind of off subject, but as long as you're on the line, mind if I ask something? Go for it. It's something I've been meaning to ask for a while. Okay. So, what do you think about Yukiko and Chie? Are they really... I mean, well, let's not mince words. Which one's your type? Oh, boy. That's a tough one. That's a really tough one. I'd I I'd feel it would feel wrong to say both.
I feel like between the two of them, Chie Chie would be I would rather the game not be coy about you know uh you, know, you should do XYZ and it says you decided XYZ, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um I think I might go with Yukiko here. I was trying to think like me personally, which would I which would I be more into? And I think Chie strikes me as someone that I would love to hang out with, but would become a handful really quick. Whereas Yukiko seems a lot less a lot less much. You know what I mean? I don't know if this will matter at all, but we'll do that. Oh, I had a feeling you'd say that. Cool. She's actually pretty interesting. I never knew she was like that. She she knows how to laugh. It's crazy. My image of her has changed completely, but I like her way better now. Okay. Hey, but don't worry. This is just between you and me. Nobody look. Nobody look. <laughs> Cute. Ah, yes, the famous flip phone hung up sound. Boop, boop, boop. Isn't that, that's a busy signal. That doesn't belong for like four different reasons. Oh yeah, Pokemon Legends ZA. Uh, I am really down for that. I, li I really enjoyed, I really enjoyed Legends Arceus. I was surprised to see Kalos get get lit up for that and not uh, Johto uh, or even Unova. Uh, but I, it's it certainly seemed like we are both getting a new Legends game and we are sort of getting the Pokemon Z we never got ten years ago. So I'm I'm very excited for it. I'm looking forward to it. It's going to be a long wait for it next year. Obviously, we'll do a a let's play of it as well. Uh, and considering we're not going to have like five open world games that we're doing at the, uh, simultaneously, I think we'll be able to stick to it uh, schedule wise a little easier too. I think it's Zygarde and As, or is the A another Pokemon? Um, I don't think it's As because As is three thousand years old. He the the war that he was the king of Kalos during was way before that. Uh, my bet is that A is going to be a new Pokemon. Um, I, uh, I made my guess in the, uh, uh, in the discord that like, it's going to be something called like Alfana or something, but, uh, he was still there a hundred years ago too. I mean, maybe it's a little unclear what he does in all that interim. Uh, so I'm sure uh, there's a good chance he'll appear probably, but beyond that, it'd be so... <coughs> I guess it's pretty far away. I was going to say, I, I kind of hope that there's some amount of crossover with Pokemon Legends. Like, hell, maybe at some point... Because uh, the time period should be pretty similar. Late 19th century, essentially. Uh, Professor Laventon could absolutely be taking a trip to Kalos around that time, and, and we run into him or something. Um, as his flow out would be interesting, too, for sure. Uh, is like Aegislash or something. Uh, I, they, I don't think they'd quite platform Aegislash quite so high. Uh, for that. Um, the A could also be Arceus. Uh, Z A certainly sounds like going back in time, like Z to A instead of A to Z. Uh, there's, um, oh, what was I going to say? So Arceus obviously has its time stuff, and in addition, uh, uh, the there's the whole, like, eco, you know, uh, um, local ecology and ecosystem stuff that is Zygarde's big thing. So there's there's some interesting stuff there. They looks like the ultimate weapon. Uh, I guess the ultimate weapon has more of a flower shape to it overall. Like I guess it, but it, like it's it almost looks like a crystal thing. If I remember correctly, it's been I I, I haven't seen it in a while, but. Um, the real world event that, that Legends Arceus was inspired by is only like a decade away from the real world events. People assume that uh, Legends ZA is based on. Um, oh, before it bloomed. That's fair. That's a good point. Uh, but yeah, no, the, the construction of what the Eiffel Tower was like the 1880s, I think. Um, and the rough period that Legends Arceus would have been would have also been like... Uh, um, you know, Japan, Japan during like the mid to late 19th century as well.
Okay, yeah, that does look a little bit like the the weapon when it's closed. That's fair. Urban redevelopment of Paris was back was in the back half of the 1800s. Yeah, okay. I just figured what with the Lumios Tower itself that they're going to base it off the Eiffel Tower specifically, but which would put it in basically the 1880s. Didn't look like the social type. Well, we don't have any social links with him yet. Now there is an understatement. Isn't he really scary? Did you see the new special oh, the other day? Oh, and also the um the next Pokemon Legends game being Kalos instead of Johto does at least implicitly bring the odds up from like zero to maybe 5% of there being a Let's Go Johto as opposed to before when it seemed like it was likely they were going to do a uh, like uh, Legend Celebi or something where Let's Go Johto would seem kind of silly. Um, the the A also definitely has like a leafy sort of aesthetic to it, so there's there's a lot of room for stuff that could that could be involved with that too. Renovation of Paris started back in, uh, started in 1850. Colonization of Hokkaido was started in the 1860s. So yeah, they're they they are basically like right on top of each other. If anything, ironically, if they ever did a Legends uh, game set in Unova, that'd be, I mean, unfortunately, it'd be right around the time of the Civil War, but there's also, I think that's more or less around the time, of, when, when was the Industrial Revolution? Because that was also 19th century, wasn't it? Oh, I guess it kind of, no, that's more early 19th century. It started end of the, wow, that is a much larger span than I usually think about. Interesting. I always think of it as as later on. I don't know, but regardless, uh, although if they wanted to, if they could figure out a way to do it without it being a um, controversial plot point, they could actually have some kind of war in Unova. Be a little bit weird considering they try to focus on like friendship and unity and stuff, and try to cool down the uh, the conflict as best they can. <coughs> yeah, I saw it. Um, but yeah, Victorian times, I mean, Galler obviously has some interesting stuff if they went that way too. He wasn't like that when he was younger though. Oh, they knew each other. You know him, Yukiko? Uh-huh. But we haven't talked to each other in a long time. He's too busy beating up motorcycles. His family runs a textile shop and we've been a customer of theirs for many years. So I speak with Kanjikun's mother from time to time. Okay. Oh, why don't we go there now? Sure. To talk to him in person. The project started in Hokkaido literally centuries earlier, but the one that succeeded was the push by Emperor Meiji in 1869. Okay. Sounds good. At the very least, we can ask if anything strange has come up lately. So again, if they are constructing the Lumios Tower like it looked like they were, and that is meant to be taking place essentially in the same time that the Eiffel Tower is built, it'd be a maximum of like 20 years later. I, I think the Eiffel Tower was completed in 1889. I wouldn't want to run into him in a dark alley, but I'm pretty sure he won't fly off the handle at his family's store. Which, interestingly, so that would also be... I, I never really thought about the fact the Eiffel Tower was being worked on and then completed, and then 10 years later, uh, everybody went and killed the king. Or overthrew the king, is maybe... I, I forget if they actually killed the king or not. They... The guillotine was a big old thing right at the turn of the 19th century. All right, then let's get going. Let's do it. If things get rough, we're counting on Law people side. died. All right, Kanji Satsuma. Let's do it. Hello. Hi. <sighs> Yuki-chan, it's so nice to see you. Beautiful shop. Well then, if you'll excuse me, ma'am. I'm sorry that I couldn't help more. It's all right. You've given me plenty to think about. Thank you. I'm intrigued by the description, slender young man. It's a very, it's a very, um, uh, um, oh my god, I've forgotten the word. My brain jumped to ambidextrous. That's obviously wrong. Um. Nope, it's out of my head. I think you know what I mean. But like, I, the the voice sounds like a woman's voice, 
and the description and the face drawing and stuff, it does kind of a, a little bit look like uh, the protag from from three, which is funny. Androgynous, thank you. Yes, that's the word I'm I'm looking for. Hi. Okay, bye. What's up with him? First intercontinental telegraph line was put up during the Buchanan presidency. God damn. Never seen him before. Yuki-chan, you're as lovely as always. Aww. <clears throat> your features are starting to remind me of your mother when she was young. Before that, you looked like no one I've ever seen before. How can I help you today? Are you out shopping with your friends? Yeah, let's oh, all get some sweet um, jackets. Well, actually. Mm-hmm. Yosuke is just like, who put all this Neapolitan ice cream out? This scarf. I've seen this somewhere before. Which scarf? The red one? Huh? Oh, you're right. Where was that? Oh, it was that place inside the TV. Hmm? That's right. That room with those faceless posters. Oh, geez, yeah. Then it's that announcer. Ah, uh, yeah. Are you acquaintances of Miss Yamino? Well, kind of. Mm. Um, did Miss Yamano happen to have a scarf like this? Yes. It was a special order she placed. Did Ka did Kanji hand deliver it to her? She actually ordered a pair. But in the end, she said she only wanted the women's scarf. Hmm. It left us with no choice but to sell this one separately. Oh, man. There is a connection to the first case. What are we going to do? Solve it. How should I know? <laughs> Hello? Delivery here for the Tatsumis. Ding dong, ding dong. I'll be right there. I'm sorry. You'll have to excuse me. Oh, it's okay. We should get going. <laughs> I'll come again, ma'am. Is that so? Well, then please say hello to your mother for me. Yeah, I feel like shit kicked off a lot faster in three. Like, you basically show up and immediately have to shoot yourself in the head with a spirit gun to to start defending the uh, the building. And then you're on a fucking runaway train immediately after that. It really is connected to the first case after all. But it's just a scarf. Would the killer target someone just because of that? No witnesses. Damn it, what's going on? <laughs> Come on, let's talk outside. Hmm. I mean, the bigger question is why she ordered a pair. Hmm? It's Kanji-kun. <laughs> is that the Scooby-Doo comparisons? Yeah, we definitely are, like, kind of doing a mystery thing with our team. Well, quick, hide! Why? Why? What? You're Dude's got the face of a 32-year-old man. What they're saying. Oh my god. T tomorrow's fine with me. Huh? S school. Of course I'm going to school. Then I'll meet you at the gates after school tomorrow. They they are making me feel like they're a like chauffeur or something. I think with the hat. And like the matching blue outfit. D did he did he say he was interested? He's a guy. And I'm a guy, but He's interested in me? <laughs> huh? What the hell are you pricks looking Whoops, at? Whoops, uh-oh. Wait, he's he's supposed to be younger than our team? Bullshit. He's even worse in person than on TV. The one on TV last night was definitely kanji -kun. Yeah, you, uh, uh, interesting. I feel like Yukiko, hmm, I could see parts of both Daphne and, um, Velma going on there. Yosuke is definitely shaggy. Are we Fred, I guess? Yeah, we're Fred. I could also see Chia being, like, either scrappy or... I don't know. I could also just easily see her walking around going, "My glasses." Remember the common points we were talking about? 
His mom fits the pattern. Oh, she's is she the, woman, the target? She knew Ms. Yamano. But it was her son who appeared on TV. So what does that mean? Could be that they're both targets. This was a tricky one, actually. I'm gonna say they're both targets. Whoa, I hadn't thought about that. Oh, maybe it's similar to my case. Oh, Teddy strikes me as as pretty scrappy for sure. If you think about it, my mother fit the victim profile more than I did. She was the one who dealt directly with Miss Yamano, but I was the one who was targeted. So the ones who are pulled in are are done so specifically to, uh, uh, like, as retribution against the other person. Like, Yukiko was taken as, like, retribution against her mother. Same thing with Kanji. He'd be taken specifically to inflict pain on his mom. Does that mean it'll be the kid again instead of the mother? But if that's true, then the killer's motive makes no sense at all. It'd have nothing to do with silencing witnesses or revenge or anything. You think we're on the wrong track? Maybe even the first case had nothing to do with grudges or revenge. I missed the part where we kind of decided that that wasn't what was going on. Or is there some kind of secret in the textile shop itself? Couch is always not super, is not always super comfortable. I'm trying to just get into a comfy sp position here. I'm totally lost. There we go. That will do. But we can't ignore this. Can't we, though? Hmm. Why don't we just go ahead and ask Kanji himself? We could at least see if anything odd's happened lately. He scares the wits out of me, but... I'm expecting him to walk up right now and be like, Are you guys following me? Hey, wasn't Kanji making <coughs> plans with that weird kid a moment ago? Something about meeting up at school? I heard he's been skipping school ever since the new year started. Doesn't that seem a little suspicious? It's a long-ass yeah, time to be skipping school. did seem weird. Is Japan just okay with kids skipping school for, like, months or years at a time? This is the second game we're playing actively right now where the main character, or the main character, where a character has skipped school for seemingly, like, portions or entire years. It's suspicious, all right. There's something funny going on here. I can sense it. Yeah, the jokes. Sense? You sound like Teddy. Still, we might find some clues. I hope so. All right. Let's try staking out both Kanji and his family store. We definitely don't want the killer getting ahead of us. That being it's said, true. Sometimes they sometimes they they sleep for number? a long time. Hey, was this your plan all along? Oh my God! Somebody like, please give him the benefit of the doubt at least once. Uh, no, I got everybody's phone number except for hers. Yeah. And the Y section of my address book needs some filling out. Okay, you're not helping. <sighs> While we're on the subject, could you stop calling me at night just to tell dirty Jesus, Yosuke. <laughs> you really sound like a pervert. Oh, my God. Hey, I'm trying to have a conversation with Yukiko here. Ah. Hmm. Oh, that reminds me. I need to buy tofu on my way home. That reminds you? She didn't hear a word I said. Okay, then. The stakeout is set for tomorrow. Okie doke. Hmm. Stakeouts? Tailing people? <laughs> I'm getting goosebumps. Oh, boy. Okay. Got our plan for tomorrow. 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 Boys school pretend they're in gangs when they run around. Oh my god. Okay, so it's not raining. Ah, oh, come on. Fine. Yeah, 
Razzmer Frazzmer. Uh, hi, everybody. Has the target arrived at school? This is super not suspicious. Yes, ma'am. Visual ID confirmed. Target arrived in zone near the end of his mess break with mother issued rations in hand. You can use regular words, Yosuke. Current status in the bathroom fixing his hair. How would you know that from here? The target was acting nervous. I left my position before he had a chance to pick on me. <laughs> I wonder what kind of plans they made. It didn't seem like he knew that boy very well. <sighs> I think there's something more subtle. Oh, he's here. Okie doke. Oh no, he's poison type. I didn't keep you waiting, I hope. No, I uh, I just got here too. I had to pay my mortgage before I got to school. Doki doki, we're on our way. What in the world was that? Anyways, we got to hurry after them or we'll lose them. Doki doke. Okay. Then let's split up into two groups. One team will follow Kanji, and the other will stake out the shop. Stake. Roger that. How should we split the teams? I guess I'll go. I'll do Yugiko? I don't know. The other two seem like they're, like, pretty much high synergy right now. They're also both very much. So I'm pairing up with Chie. Okay. They seem like they're very, they're very much a typing this, uh, or type aing this situation. All right. We'll need to pretend we're on a date to make it look. <laughs> oh God damn it! I clearly should have grabbed Yosuke. Uh, not in a million years. There'll be no need for that if we stay out of sight. Sheesh. Let's hurry up and go. Oh poor Chie. I'm sorry. If those two will be all right, uh, they'll be fine. Okay, so we just oh. yes. <laughs> that leaves us in charge of staking out the textile shop. Yes, it does. So, shall we? <laughs> Let's shall. Clearly, I just have to like tell jokes so that she's not like anxious the entire time. Uh Sorry oh. About the wait. This one's for you. And then she plays a sweet rock ballad. Everything seems fine at the shop. I hope it stays that way. That'd be ideal, Do yeah. I think the culprit will come? I never really thought about them like that. I sure hope they don't. That'll make it much grosser. It's an interesting set of three things. I'm going to go with I'm sure of it. And we need to keep our eyes open. It would be scary if the culprit did show up. Oh. If they do, I'll do what I can to help you catch them. Uh, Kanji is indeed the youngest of the of the playable characters. I mean, I kind of assume that he was. I don't want to be the only one doing nothing. I mean, I think I remember sure him from the opening cinematic do. thing too. Oh, sorry, I went on and on without realizing. I. It's I fine. I'm a little nervous. It is fine. I've never chatted with a boy my age like this. Uh, Chie, of course, has no problem getting along with guys because of her personality. But I think she's had more fun hanging out with you and Yosuke lately. That's nice. <laughs> the same is true for me. Aww. God, oh, Jesus Christ! Splong. Oh no, it's the BJ card. <laughs> I'm sorry. Priestess. That makes sense. Whoa. Oh no, I'm covered in fairy dust. Hey. She can help. Just ask. Oh, god damn it. 
Ah, oh, fuck's sake. Oh, you're right. We'll need to contact each other if anything happens. I feel like there's a few of these courage stops that literally are not clearable at all. Like, you have no possibility. Like, granted, by now there are probably enough things I could do to get my courage up. But I mean, <laughs> it's, the, it's, the, it's the sorry, you're too much of a pussy uh, warning again. I, I, but like, there's a few near the beginning of the game that's, oh, on New Game Plus, that makes sense. So I was going to say, some of these seem totally not winnable normally. All right, no change over the shop. Okie dokie. Huzzah. But, <laughs> you know, leapfrog? Well, yeah, you're in kind of a... Just stand up. Yeah, we definitely stand out. Yes. No, I mean them. I get this weird feeling about them. Weird? What about them's weird? Oh, boy. Um, I don't know how to put it. Delicately, I hope. Maybe it's just my imagination. Mm. <laughs> hey, how do you think the others are doing? Beats me. For all we know, he's hitting on Yukiko as we speak. Yo, Sky. Yeah, no. He's not like you. Yukiko doesn't seem to be interested in that stuff anyway. Uh. Wait. Oh, Wait, Jesus. He's interested in her? Yosuke, don't do it. Huh? I, I, I wouldn't know. We don't really talk about that kind of stuff. <laughs> <sighs> now I'm even more suspicious. Oh, my God. You know something, don't you? I seriously don't know. It's not like we've been hanging out. I'm gonna say the three of us have been hanging out for like almost the exact same amount of time. What the hell are you two doing? Great job, guys. Oh well, you see, we're we're just two crazy lovebirds. What do you mean, bird? Play along, bird brain. Oh my god. Didn't I see you guys yesterday? Possibly. It's a small town. <laughs> Come on. It just so happened that we were walking Terrible by liar. Hey, our houses are just over that way, so we'll be going now. Um, look, we weren't planning on getting in you guys' Chie. Nothing strange about it either. Shut up. S strange. Why can't you keep your big mouth shut? Whoa, 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 wait. Damn it. Good. I don't know if that's quite the inflection I would give to what you think. You, you got it all wrong. Hey, are you listening, damn it? There we go. It seriously ain't like that. Oh, my God. Everything's going really well. We regret to inform that our mission failed. Oh, my God. There was nowhere to hide. Well, <sighs> let's wait here a little longer. Maybe kanji -kun will come home. All right. Yeah. Huh? What are you guys doing here? Oh boy. You're those stupid lovebirds I just saw. Oh. We're not a couple. <laughs> Why are you assholes following me around? It's a good question. This voice seems very familiar. Damn it, what the hell's going on? I ain't saying this is you guys' fault, but damn it. Hey, uh, mind if we ask something? Has anything strange happened to you lately? Benny Hill music, goddamn. Huh? Strange? What's this strange stuff, huh? Are you saying that I'm strange? Oh my god, man. Huh? No, 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 I, I didn't mean... Circumstantially. Shit, better get the hell out of my face, or I'm <coughs> taking you down! What? Why do you have an unspent bullet... Uh, uh, an unspent cartridge on your, on your necklace? Choking. Holy, you'd sound like you're choking. Oof. Yosuke. Jesus Christ. Uh, Troy Baker. Oh, oh right. yeah, that would do it. Well, nothing happened today, so I guess everything's okay. Hang on a second. Because now I'm like, is that the same person who did? It's 
Oh, he did voices in uh, in Dark Side Chronicles. I didn't know that. That's fun. Do 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 do. Oh boy, <laughs> he voiced Espio in Sonic in uh uh for for the Sonic franchise for like a decade. We're actually probably just getting now into the era where he's. I don't think we're there yet. I think we got to get into like Sonic Colors, and then he's voicing Espio. Which does mean uh, fucking Thunder Voice is going to be going away, but holy cow. It's kind of scrolling through here real quick. Oh, because I recognize his voice in general, and I've definitely heard him do other stuff before, and I was like, he sounds so specifically like one character that that I know very well, and what the hell is it? He's the default voice for the boss in Saints Row the Third. Uh, and I played the shit out of that game. I'm actually curious. I think he stuck around. I'm trying to. And, he, and for Saints Row 4 as well, which I also played a shitload of. So, yeah, that makes sense. Because I was like, man, there's definitely something that he did that specifically is standing out to me right now. And that's exactly what it is. Oh, he did one of the Infinity Blade games. Man, those got to come back. Those were actually pretty addicting and, and fun. I miss them. I miss them. Uh, Alice definitely has Mercer money after how crazy their Game Pass deal is. Yeah, you know. Uh, oh, Matt Mercer has done Kanji's voice in some other things too. Okay, interesting. That's a hell of a. That's a hell of a uh, a a VA list to have Troy Baker and Matt Mercer. As as uh, two of the voices for for that. It's already been a few days since he appeared on the Midnight Channel. If this is anything like Yukiko's case, it'll happen soon. And, and it's gonna be sunny for like a week. I think we should come back tomorrow to check up on him. SPO is clearly Kanji. Both went from Troy. Ba- both went from Troy Baker to Matt. Matt Mercer voiced Espio. What? Oh, shit. He's been voiced by Matt Mercer for almost a decade now. It was David Willis in the uh, Sonic Rivals era. Yeah, Matt Mercer since 2016. 2016 would have been right before Sonic Mania. What the hell was in 2016? Oh, that would have been the Olympics games. I think. I think the 2016 Olympics game which might have been a 2015 game was like the only thing that came out before sonic mania so sonic forces then matt mercer would have been yeah forces as well as i guess um actually is that the only thing spo has been in uh team sonic racing probably huh i guess yeah i guess they just have a similar quality about them yeah Looks like we got no choice. When's Troy Baker gonna voice Ganondorf? Let's go home. I'm wiped. Yeah, Sonic Forces. Is this guy a protagonist voiced by them? I did see that there was, I think, does this guy a four? Welcome home, big bro. Alright, we're getting more and more words to the voice lines, but the text is always saying just welcome back. Oh, is it another is it another uh, Midnight Channel night then? Alright. All right. Not a whole lot of freedom right now. <laughs> That'd be an interesting line, yeah. Hello? It's Yukiko. It is. I'm sorry to call so late. Um, Kanji kun seems to be missing. Oh, that was fast. I had some calls to make for the inn, so I called the textile shop as well. When I spoke to Kanji kun's mother, she told me that he left the house and hasn't returned since. Hmm. I mean, we know that there's risks right now. I think so too. He could be. It's going to rain again tonight. Maybe the midnight channel will come on. Hopefully. Then we'll know for sure if something happened to Kanjikun or not. I'll make sure to check out the TV at midnight. Sounds good. Talk to you later. Boop. 
Gotta love that busy signal. All righty. For algorithmic voice enhancement in cell phones. Is that a thing? No, I didn't. I, I I wasn't actually sure if that was like, if there's like an artificial bass boost or something that's going on there. Because I think it would just be... I think it would just be a high pass filter, basically. Um, also, I think that little weep, 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 that little tuning sound, I think is the same as at the beginning of. Oh God, one of the NT Warrior or Star Force uh, Japanese themes. It's it's one that's got kind of like a sunny California vibes thing to it. Um, but at the very beginning has that same whoop, 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 whoop. That looks like it kind of looks like a library or a spa. could be like a steam room like thing or something. It's kind of hard to tell. There's a lot of doors. Almost like a changing room. Oh shit, you're right. That is Kirby in the Forgotten Land. That's not Star Force. Holy shit. You're completely right. That is Kirby in the Forgotten Land. It's got a very similar vibe to a couple of the, uh, the Star Force and NT Warrior themes, which is funny. But yes, no, that is Kirby in the Forgotten Land. And I think it's just one of those like stock sound effects just in general. Hi. Hello, dear viewers. It's time for Bad Bad Bathhouse. Is the Midnight Channel just always going to be awkwardly, like, awkward, awkward fuck zone energy out of whoever the fuck is trapped? Oh, boy. I guess if the whole premise of the game is learning to, is accepting your, like, inner flaws and inner feelings that are awkward or difficult to come to grips with, it's not that unreasonable, but, like, yikes... It doesn't help that this is supposed to be, like, high schoolers and stuff, and we also literally just determined that that Kanji is the youngest of the entire group. One of the least bad scenes about Kanji's sexuality. Oh, boy. Okay. Oh, Persona 3 was not exactly delicate about, it, about things during the beach uh, episode, so... Ah... Uh... Pride yourself that you're like worried about and Kanji's definitely insecure. Yeah, yeah. Tonight I'll introduce a superb site for those searching for sublime love that surpasses the separation of the sexes. Oh boy. Oh god. So it was harder to notice in the previous line, but yeah, they're really they're really doing the whole uh lispy thing to to amp it up on this, huh? This is gonna be this is gonna be a rough one. I'm your host, Kanji Tatsumi, serving you this scandalously special sneak in report. Goodness gracious, just imagine the things that might happen to me there. Oh boy. <laughs> He, do, he does kind of... He runs like a redead from Twilight Princess. Like, very elbowy. Elbows out. Elbows akimbo. Oh, no, wait. Akimbo usually is the other one. Unless it's guns. Holy cow. Yosuke was also apparently giving me a romance option, but was cut. Oh, it's unfortunate. 
<laughs> it really was Kanji. He's gonna be learning. To, it's it's that time in his life. He's learning some things. If only we'd held our ground and stayed there a little longer. May is uh May, May of twenty what oh, twelve is apparently when Kanji is is discovering that he's a power bottom all along. In any case, that place that was behind him. What do you think it is? I, a bathhouse. It was pretty clear. Uh, clearly, it's xxx.xxx. I have no idea if that's a real website. Don't look it up. It probably is. If Pornhub was smart, they would have bought that domain as fast as they could. Or any of, honestly, any of those sites. Go, go, Power Bottoms. Oh, no. Oh, God. Holy cow. Uh, late enough that there's English dub voice lines for it. Oh, no shit. Oh, boy. Holy cow. Given the pattern so far, Kanji's already inside the TV. Yeah, probably. I wonder what the Midnight Channel really is. I mean, it seems like it's like a... a I mean... Aside from there being a clear question of who is controlling it or who's guiding it, it seems to be a, like, window into the soul of a person. As they reveal themselves in the TV station. At first, I thought it was one of those paranormal things. Hey, thank you, Monster Envy. Uh, yeah, it's been, it's been an interesting night so far. They figure free... Uh, oh, boy. Is that really what all of that is? Wow. So somebody scooped it up really fast before uh, any of the big sites could. And then the big sites were like, yeah, it ain't really worth bothering with that. Turns out it's actually connected to another world. Yes. If there's a rumor going around, that means a bunch of people are watching it. How did the rumor go? If you stare into a turned off TV on a rainy night. No one in their right mind would try something that ridiculous, don't you think? Unless someone urged them to. Yeah, so... Ooh, excuse me. So somebody has to have created the rumor in the first place. But then why would they do that? But if you actually try, it does work. And not just once. And does the TV station just exist within, like, the, like, electronic signal, I guess, of all of it? If this rumor spreads and everyone starts watching the Midnight Channel... It's going to be just like that time a few years ago when everybody turned into coffins in the middle of the night. It could cause a huge panic. If Teddy is right, the missing people themselves create well, the stuff we see. It would cause a panic, but also wouldn't it be a lot easier for, for people to realize the connection between missing folks and all of that? Apparently the XX top level demand was specifically created to make it easy for parents to block the individual sites. Yeah, but that also relies on those porn sites using dot dot triple X. So it's not random. It's specifically related to whoever goes missing. So like if I was if I was running a porn site, I mean granted I wouldn't want kids watching anyway, but if my power bottom in bio, yeah. Uh, if I wanted to not have audience get dropped down, then that would be you know, but also if the only if the idea is that it's parents that are blocking it, then like, you know, may as well just make the dot triple X at that point. Huh. Yukiko had a show too, but she doesn't remember doing anything like that. Okay, so your subconscious is subconsciously it's doing that. A little off subject, but the culprit is probably watching the shows that come on, right? Presumably. No doubt. He's probably plot. sitting back and enjoying... There's that any rumors that spread properly become real. Ooh, that's fun. It's an interesting... It's an interesting idea. Oh, wait a sec. I bet he is enjoying it. He's a fear jerker. He's probably laughing his head off watching the show that comes on after he throws people into the TV. Ah, oh, I get it. 
Yeah, it's definitely possible. Certainly a possibility, yeah. Ugh. Now when I think of the killer, I get this image of a total sicko. I want to see everything about you, Yuki-chan. Ew. Yukiko show. Do you think people were watching what happened to me too? Oh, that is it. That killer is dead meat. I'm gonna leave footprints all over his face. Holy cow, Chie. Guys. Yep. First we save Kanji, then we crush the killer. We're gonna put him under a, a steamroller. Finally, we crush the killer and send him to hell. Got it? Well, you already said crush the killer. We're doing it twice. Is the team gonna go? Oh, Jesus. Ching. Level three. <laughs> oh boy, it started. Chie, okay, no thank you. The same thing. Yeah, there were some rumors of Persona Two. I saw there was some leaker that was, I guess, really has been really popular on Twitter lately, and their stuff's been getting reposted a lot. And it sounded like Persona 2 was on the horizon for getting a remake. Uh, I know. It's a weird order to do it in, but also... Because isn't it that Persona 2... How to, how to do this? Persona 2, the first one, hey, Teddy, takes place in the right? same timeline as Persona 1, but Persona 2, the second one branches off and is and is instead connected to like creates you know the timeline that now has three four and five in it or something oh yep i think someone's here you think do you know where he is i don't know There we go. Sorry, I had uh, we had beef stew for dinner, and there was like a little piece of something that's been stuck between two of my teeth, driving me crazy. All I good think now. It's a boy named Kanji. He's a boy named Words. I don't know. What's wrong? Not feeling well? Yeah, sometimes it's blah, just his zipper. Just blah. Uh, P two punishment is a separate timeline from P two sin. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Any of the first Persona two creates the new timeline. I think. Yeah, that was my understanding of it as well. That the ending creates a new timeline, and then the second one, which I guess is punishment, uh, essentially starts from the same place as the uh, starts from the same place as sin, but quickly starts to diverge as a result of it being a new timeline or something. Be a hell of an achievement if they could pull that off again. But yeah, Persona Two: Sin and Punishment would be yeah, it'd be. If anything, honestly, I'd be more impressed. I don't know what Persona 2 looks like as a game, really, but we played a little bit of Persona 1, I want to say, uh, on the channel as part of um, the PlayStation Classic, right? Because I think, I think that was Persona 1. And that one's like old school mostly top down until you're in like the 3D exploration. Yeah, Revelations Persona. Played it about three, three and a half years ago for the PlayStation Classic. Yeah. So what I'd be very interested to see is if they remade Persona 1. It's a normal Atlas RPG, more dungeon crawling mechanics than you'd expect. I'd be really intrigued by if they remade Persona one in the style of modern persona games like take the same general premise but do it up more like this and then persona 2 doing so like closer to the smt formula yeah dungeon crawlers it'd be interesting if like it'd be hard to justify it unless they tried to do the resident evil thing and try to like loosely tie that in with whatever Persona 6 will have happen. Like fuck, if Persona 6 were, is about bringing all of that shit back together, you know, or something. Aren't you thinking too much about too many things? No. I mean, last time you were wondering about who you really are and how long you've been here. 
That's a very normal thing for him to be wondering. Your head's empty to begin with, dude. Don't stress out over stuff too much. Oh my god. Reimagining the plane rem Oh yeah, no, I think I think like you know, uh, uh, remake, not remaster, right? A Persona 1 remaster would seem kind of awkward and weird in a modern setting, but a Persona 1 remake, uh, uh, I think, would, would be the way that, that would have to go. You're right. Someone unzip me. I'm done. Whoa. He's seriously down about this. Oh, did they do a Persona remaster? Let's see. Uh, a port to the PSP. Yeah, a port to the PSP retitled Shin Megami Tensei Persona. Well, that's confusing that it was Revelations Persona and then became SMT Persona. On the, uh, I guess it was just called Persona in Japan on the PSP, which is the smart way to go. This port featured new cutscenes and a reworked English localization that was more faithful to the original Japanese release. Okay. But yeah, I don't know. If they did a full-blown remake of it from the ground up, I think that could be kind of interesting. One and both twos for PSP. And I mean, they also obviously released PS uh, uh, Persona 3. Not Fess. I forget what the name of it was for the PSP one there. And then wasn't, uh, wasn't Persona 4 also... Uh, didn't that also have a PSP release? Persona 3 Portable, yeah. Yep. If you can't figure out where Kanji for, is... Uh, for his Vita. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yep, that's alright. We can't just wander around aimlessly in a place like this. Yes, yeah, the golden one. I know what might help. You should give me a clue about this Kanji person. Okay. He has a jacket like two of us are wearing. It's just a feeling I have. I think I could concentrate better with it. I don't think I've ever played anything on the PS Vita. I don't think I own one. Do you have anything that could give me a good understanding of him? Something about Kanji, huh? <laughs> I can't really think of anything besides all the rumors about him. Yeah, it's not like we know him that well. I just need some sort of hint. Something that tells me what he's really like. Why don't we ask around and find people who know Kanji Kun personally? All right. More information about Kanji. Okay. Can I stay here and do stuff? No! Uh... Is the... Is, are, are all those like pillar things there meant to indicate that that is a place that, that is the place we should be going or is that just because their radio towers are also sticking out of the map but I have not noticed a little beach ball looking thing there either I'll tell you stuff that you the player have noticed but you didn't have the common sense yeah right um uh, yeah uh it's gonna be interesting. Uh, Nintendo is about to crack down real hard on um, on the uh, Switch emulation scene, which, like, you know, regardless of how you feel about it personally, there's it's like, man, apparently was it Vuzu or something? They they openly stated that there that there were more than one million downloads of Tears of the Kingdom, and it's like. Yeah, Nintendo's not really just going to sit by and let that happen. That's like $50 million or more. Like, that's not a small amount of money as compared to like, oh, here's, you know, an out-of-print 3DS game or something. Or here's an N64, you know, game that's been downloaded 5 million times, but you literally can't buy it otherwise. I think the 3DS was still peripheral... Uh, um, not peripheral. Um, oh, God, there's a name. Uh, proprietary enough. And it was also, like, really strongly encrypted. Nowadays, they're all basically just apps being played on computers. So they're, like, I feel like there's more access to it, you know? Um, 
and yeah, no, I just I just rather have the games. And honestly, I'd, I'd prefer to support the studios making the games that I like. You know. All right, this is not next shipment is May twentieth. Oh, there's another shipment coming in in two days. Jesus Christ. Oh my God. I gotta make a point of buying that like tomorrow. I just don't have the cash for it now, and I wanna wait until the point where we're going to go into the into the studio for real. To uh. Oh yeah, yeah. To uh, to do my fusions in case I can get some more social link points. These people knew Kanjikin's family or their shop, but all I heard were bad rumors of people saying he was cute when he was little, that kind of thing. So I'll talk to the last person who saw him, but I'm not sure who that would be. His mom? Oh, 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 the slender young boy or whatever it was. Books don't disappear. That's good. Um, now, where is... Could they be at the shrine? Nope. I guess I could check the school. But they were coming from outside the school, so the odds seem kind of low. Very golden hour vibes today. Uh, let's check the floodplain, actually. Like, let's check some other areas first. I guess I should also go and check with mo with uh, his mom. I said it, and then I didn't go and do it, which was kind of dumb. Let's go down here. Okay, going to town. Let's go back up here for a sec. You know, there was a small boy who came in asking about him not too long ago. I talked to him too, but I haven't seen him around lately. Okay, so I search for the boy. Yeah, was already trying that. Okay. Will they now appear? Oh yeah, no, I know I knew that the, the shop was next to the shrine, yeah. Um Let's try the floodplain again real quick. I guess I could also try outside my house on the off chance they're hanging around there. Rechecking in case that dialogue bit actually triggered them uh, showing up. I guess I can check the outside of Juness, or like the first floor rather. Don't want to right now. Hang around here lately. I don't spend all that stuff with the incident. We'll be back tomorrow. Ah, damn it. Okay. Um. I just want to check in here real quick to double check how much money how much money I do have free. Hello. Just drop the thing again. Apparently the traditional PS4 emulator is already publicly available. PS5 emulator is being actively worked on Jesus Christ. That seems like a lot of fucking work for most computers to be able to pull off right now. Seafoam. Listen. 
to my voice. Sea bears foam, sleep bears dreams. My shouting, bellowing voice. Here I am. Crash. Pouring my blood into my words. Yelling at the very edge of the world. I am the little mermaid. Unable to return. The little mermaid. Faded to foam. The little mermaid. Aww. It's a slightly tricky one. I feel like for English audiences at this point, the phrase the little mermaid has a really specific connotation, but like that'd be more the original Hans Christian Andersen. I think it was Hans Christian Andersen that did the actual original little mermaid, like the story that became like the story that Disney then kind of worked over. Right. Yeah. A little mer. Yeah. Oh boy. It's fine. It's fine. I'm yelling at the edge of the world that this is not a poem. Oh, Marie. I don't know what I'm saying. Where's it just coming out? I stupid. I hate you jerk. I can't believe this. Don't read my things. It is totally fine. Why was it on the floor? I don't get it. It's fine. It was nice. I liked it. Uh, check compendium. View compendium. So the two that I was going to buy were going to be... I think it was Titan for 8,000. And was it Jack Frost? So 13.6. I remember it was at least that, and those are the two most expensive ones that are here. So I'm going to just go ahead and assume that that is correct. So I have 2,200 monies that I can work with. So I think I might go buy that book. Just the one. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, no. It's like just a little too much. Let me 13 even. Can I sell 600 worth of stuff right now? Uh, who can I even sell to? Because I think he only takes specific things, right? Or no. He'll take he'll take uh, other stuff, too. I could sell the chainmail. What was the one that I that I wanted to hang on to? I cannot remember. I could sell one of these. I mean, they're going to be extremely valuable later, I assume, but... I could also sell an Iolite. I have not been using those very much right now. Uh, this guy's old weapon, you don't need it. Yeah, I like to I like to hang on to them as long as I can. I think there was like an armor piece or something that I guess I'm wearing right now. Um, I'm just gonna sell Iolite. I'm gonna sell one. Actually, you know what? Let's sell three because they'll get me to eighteen. All right, so fifteen hundred and twenty hundred is forty uh, forty three hundred. So I want to be at seventeen nine hundred. Doing that math right. 2800 plus 1500 for the two books is 4300. I need 13,600 plus the 43 is 17900. Yeah. Whoops. Let's come the controller drop for a second there. So now I can afford both books. Let's buy both books. Yeah, office work manual is the one that increases diligence. So I'm just going to go home and read, I think. If I can't find the boy, then I may as well just go home and read. 
should be the music. If only for a moment to make the player think they need the accessory to hear the soundtrack. That'd be that'd be a cute little thing to have there. No, wait. If I return home, does that make it evening right away? I should do something outside of home. Yeah, exactly, yeah. So let's do something in town. I guess the big thing would be go to the restaurant, right? What do they have, what do they have on today? Only 800. And it'll raise diligence. That'll bring me down to 13,799. And I need 13,600, so that is fine. So I'll do that. Oh, I guess I guess that's true. Uh I don't know what kind of social links are going to be available today. Cuz I don't have any clubs. There's no clubs on Wednesdays. It didn't look like Marie was out either. Oh, okay. We got one over there. Oh, hang out with the with the athletes, I guess. Today's not a practice day. What? Wait a minute. Okay. Oh boy, I did not need all of this right now. Yeah, practice on Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. I guess I guess it's just like, uh, hey, do we want to have a free practice day? Yeah. Sure. Oh, I should have checked on the roof. Oh, well. It is good to have the diligence go up this way, too. The balls have been polished. Oh, baby. Let's grub some grabs. Oh, hey, Aya. <laughs> can I can I Whoa. eat the sweet dish at Aya, too? That'd be great. What? Just remember some... Oh. Bumsy Wumsy. How, uh, is day he goes before the almighty house of Ichijo. What? Hmm. Okay. I don't really like talking behind his back like this, but I want you to help him out. Just tell me how. Yeah. Thanks. Sweet. Butko's family. He lives by himself at his parents' place is like right next door. Once a week or so he drops by there like he did today. Family is, what's the word I'm looking for? Distinguished, very traditional, very strict. You never notice by looking at him, though. Okay. Co's grandma. They follow her orders like she's the law. Problem is, the old crone doesn't approve of him playing basketball. She calls it barbaric. More like bar basketball. Yeah, that sucks. Yeah. He's been forced to quit a lot of things since he was a kid, but not basketball. He can't give this up, so I want you to help him out. Sure. All right. So what do I go? Ah! You've got more basketballs. Alrighty. Can my diligence go up? That'd be great. Uh, I used up my allowance. How about some Jacai? Good. I'm assuming that is a, a free a free thing that is there. Basket bar uh, basket baric. 
boop be ba doop Oh, what's up? Um, sure. Why the hell not? Cool. Neat. Alrighty. Another sunny day. Bape us. We won't have to worry about the fog for a while. So let's so let's keep cool like usual. We can save the day and still keep our skills sharp. It's a good plan. It's not going to do anyone any good if we get anxious. Let's be sure to use the time we have until the next foggy day to our advantage so we can save him for sure. Okay. Pickled vegetables usually a side, not their own dish. Yeah. That sounds about right. Hey, everyone. They posted the test results. Right. I almost, I missed one question, so I'm curious how this is going to go. I'm assuming there's a there's a little prize of some sort. For getting them all right, but. Top 10. Hey. I assume if you get them all right, you literally get the best score in the school. Whoa. Oh, that's fun. Do you get... Oh, damn. Did I just get points with, like, a bunch of dudes at once? All right, that's fun. I guess it did say that if you get if you score well, then you become more popular, so... Hi, Yumi. Sorry, just kind of tired. You're going to come to practice, right? Yeah. I don't think I've been to the drama club in a bit. First need to gather information for Teddy. I did make plans. I guess this was a bad day to do that, considering I was supposed to go and check on Juness. Whoops. You get perfect, but it's very hard for the first semester. Yeah. Expression is up. Hey, nice. Oh shit, there was something that was barred off by not being eloquent. I forgot what it was. Whoop. The bell isn't rung yet. You want to quit early? You're slacking off. You need to take this more seriously. It's not drama, it's life! I feel like I'm the only one who cares about this club. Stop holding us back. The reason you get any, never get any lead roles is because you act like that. Dang, girl. It is time to go home. Please don't forget anything. It's time to go home now anyway. Let's also stop for today, all right? Okay. Awkward. Oh, nice. All right. Is I wrong when I said that? I feel like this is, this is the true answer. Might not be the best one, but I think that that's the real answer. It was a loud thing there. Practice controlling my emotions in this club, and it still doesn't help me in real life. It smiles wryly. What? Okay. Yeah, I'll help. Okay. There's nobody at my house. Mom's been going straight to the hospital. I'll have to work to see him. There's no real point to going home now. When I'm by myself at home, I can't stop thinking about all that stuff. The past, why things turned out the way they did, you know. I thought I'd forgotten them. Sorry, I've just been whining. No. See, like, man, the, having the polar options here, like an okay if you're sure feels like a little bit more real, but okay is a little bit more like, okay is just sort of like, you got it, yeah, cool. I could see this one going over well. I can't forget, she was really not thrilled with feeling like we were being invasive before, and that is kind of what this one feels like. Like, we're just like, no, I'm making this my business, and it's like, it is not our business. <laughs> like, we're there to, to help out and stuff. Hey, hello, Twinby Mark II. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Okay, cool. She's she's happy that we are, are cool with her choice 
That's how I keep I keep going. No matter what happens, I will go on. Yeah, that's right. Thank you. If I was by myself, I'd have been down in the dumps for a while. I just know it. So I'm glad you were here. <laughs> Hope you'll stick around for a while longer. Sweet. Oh, God. Everyone get down. Schwing. Moving pretty quickly through Yumi's social link, actually. 80% of her day smiling, Riley. All right. A couple months ago, I've been binging videos like crazy. Oh, thank you very much. I hope you've been... I, I assume you have, but I hope you've been enjoying it so far. We have a stupidly insane amount of video content on the channel. Uh, I I don't think we're... We're coming up on 11,000 Let's Play videos which is a bonkers-ass number that's really hard to accept is real. Uh, we also have the Unpause channel that's hopefully making it a little easier to, to watch as uh, as compared to the, like, mountain of videos on the main channel. I'm going to stop somewhere on my way home and practice more there. I finally got a lead role. I have to make sure I can do it. All right. All right. I'll see you at school. Sounds good. Oh, my God. You're back. Yes, indeed. About that thing I asked you before. Have you seen Adachi at Juness since then? I haven't. I've heard more and more reports of him just being being seen just sitting around at Juness looking bored. Mm. If they find out he's been shirking work, there's no telling what kind of trouble he'll get into. If it turns out that Adachi is the bad guy in all of this, it really does feel like if they were try if that is what's going on cuz it could just as easily be them laying down a really unsubtle red herring but if it's not if it's actually what's going on here it's like man i feel like they were maybe aiming for it to be a little bit more of a subtle yeah there's just stuff's going on in the world of these characters but it's like we've leaned into it so hard if you spot a dachi juness you tell him that hmm okay so he did well. They say. I don't know who they is, but. Uh, <laughs> hard to believe it was a cop who's bad at his job. Oh, no. I, I He's de he's clearly bad at his job also. Heard about it when I was investigating. How did that come up? It's good to see you're taking care of your responsibilities, even though you just moved here. I need to act like an uncle every so often and give you some spending money. But don't spend it all in. Nah, you can use it however you like. Yo! Dang. Hey, good job of those tests. Here's 200 bucks. Fuck me. All right. Hey. I don't consider myself an old man yet, but when it comes to high schoolers, I don't know what to talk about. Oh, wait. Okay, hang on. Not yet? Not I want to see if I can go and... Uh, Maybe I can buy equipment tomorrow. Because now I can actually afford all the equipment that I would want to get. Alrighty. It's going to discover an acorn murdered all the... <laughs> Alrighty. Hey. What have you been doing after school? Hang with friends, club meetings. I have not been working. I'll do club meetings. Why not? When I was your age, I used to like clubs so much that I'd be willing to cut class to attend the meetings. How? Okay. Not that I did cut class, though. Oh, my God. It's turning into interrogation, isn't it? But it's not as if we have much in common except for the murders. Jesus Christ. I mean, aren't we related? That's something we have in common. That's just a mean one. Let's do Tell Me About Yourself. About me? You're just doing the strangest things. What? It's just what it seems. I'm a simple country detective living... I'm a simple country detective living with my daughter. <laughs> There's nothing about that to interest a high school kid. I mean, that's not totally true. But you know, it really is good to have you around the house. I didn't think Nanako would be so happy. Hell, I'm already tired of hearing big bro this and big bro that. You're more like a very young brother to me than a son. This is a really confusing family dynamic, man. Should I call you big bro? 
All right, I'm glad that he got a kick out of that. Sending chills down my spine is not quite the response I was expecting there, but all right. Your cousin's your mom and her dad is your brother. Yeah, this, this is getting confusing very fast. I've got a cousin who's calling me brother and an uncle who I'm calling brother. It's all going really normally right now. Oh, God. You wanted friends or work for the first one? Yeah. I think it's been a while since I've laughed this much. Nice. Yay! Oh, God, they're outside! Quick! Dive, dive, dive! Herophant. Have to finish processing some data for work. Don't hit the sack too late, you hear? The hospital's not open that late, so we gotta we gotta take care of it earlier. Alright. Nope, no chance to read. Okay. Alright. Come after several days of rain. Okay. Let's try Juness. Was your thing? Oh, you were the one with the angel statue. Yeah, yeah. Let's go upstairs before we go anywhere. That is, I think, devil statue person. Boop a doop a do 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 do. Move down that way. Got the ghosting effect is like really. Yeah, she's here. All right, I did that. I'm just going to do them in order. Hobbies. Playing with animals, I guess. All right, so one more day and I'll be able to report back. Um, let's go to the shopping district first. Oh, there should be new books in, too. All right, English made easy for expression and easy origami for understanding. So I'm going to have two understanding books. All right. All righty. All right, do I have weapons for everybody? Yeah, those are all going to be worse there. Uh, it's got the skill spanner. Which is better than all of these. Nan Nanman Gusoku. And the No Fan. Alright, so they all have their best weapon. Armor. Lion Hoppy. Oh, the Gentleman's Tux we wanted to keep. That's right. 50 hit points or double defense, essentially. It might be worth going for the lion hoppy. Um, Chie having evade fire medium is kind of nice. Even though this is a nice big boost, I think the bonus to evading fire specifically is kind of nice for her right now. Uh, Yuki, though. Yuki uh, probably could do with a proper different uh, setup here. Oh, but that, okay, no, I can't go doing... That's a little too expensive right now, considering what I still need to be... Um, what I still need to be buying later. Okay, I think we're, we're okay for now. Alrighty, um... I think let's head for Juness. Yeah. Are we gonna wind up? Oh, hey. Oh. What's the matter? Can I help you? Dojima sent me. These are some interesting options here. Nope. This sucks. Well, obviously I'm working here. It's easy to investigate here with all the people around. It's cool in the summer and warm in the winter. It's a pretty good place Oops. to... 
live? Do you live here? Well, this will be interesting. Oh, it's a little strange. Killing time. Eh, killing time. It's not like the city at all. You can say that again. Sure. You're right. You need to understand you're from the city too, right? <sighs> Get this. My first assignment here was tracking down a cat. My suit got so dirty and they wouldn't let me expense the dry cleaning bill. Next, I played peacemaker and a peacemaker and a spat some married couple was having. I can't believe they got the police doing that stuff. But it's been more dangerous lately, so I can't kick back. There's that one case, you know? It's still not solved yet. The higher-ups don't know what to do. They keep changing procedure on the fly. Sorry. I'm not making you nervous. You guys have nothing to worry about, you know? Us police are on the job. Okay, we... All right. Oh, no, we've been shot. Us having a social link with Adachi... Isn't that the fool, Arcana? The Jester Arcana. It's a different Dex Arcana Zero. Huh. Well, you know. Hmm. I'm like continuing to be suspicious just because that it's the same zero it like so it's another zero arcana which is very interesting which makes it feel like a parallel kind of deal there see ya don't tell Dojima-san I was in Juness okay I, but, uh. hmm damn it I really need to go find the the ah God damn it. Hi. Sure. Yeah. It seems like social links, generally speaking, are always the way to go if you've got an option for them, but... Whoop. Yeah, what's wrong? Um. All right. You're an only child. I, I, I assume that this is up to the... I'll say yes for my character. I'm not an only child in real life, but... <laughs> but, yeah, but I have you now, so... Aw. All right, that our family won't get any bigger, but now I have a big brother. Cool. Oh, God, the TV exploded. Shit. Rank up. Um, good news is that you didn't miss the boy because he's only there certain days. <sighs> I assume that they're that they're in the lobby. Then, yeah. I want to hear about your school. Yeah, we talk about stuff. Oh, okay, doggy. Good night. Good night. Okay. Working on it. It's been... Oh. Does that look darker than... No, it's the same gray. That said, if she's on the roof right now, then I can get the third answer and come right back. Not yet. Do, 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 do. Uh, I'm going to do the smart thing. So I'm going to do this, and then I'm going to talk to the... Dreams. Want to become a vet. That's why I study so much. Oh, is there a fourth one that only comes up after you've uh, after you've asked about the other three things? Uh, nope. What? What? Am I not even allowed to finish? To, to like continue all right or maybe I just can't anyway because I've only got three things K 
Okay. So let's go into town. Let's check Juness first. Because that is more important than... Ah! Oh, actually. Let's also buy some of these. I can afford it now. You! Many people from town come and meet here. It's a very convenient location, isn't it? You're asking if anything seems strange when I spoke to Kanjikun, yes? Very well. It seems to be an urgent matter, so I'll simply tell you. If you're asking about recent events, then yes, there was something out of the ordinary. It was something I felt when I was with him, so I told him outright that he seemed to be an odd person. Yo, you can't just say that at people. Jeez. Especially when they're in the middle, in the middle of, you know, an awakening. After I said that, his expression changed all of a sudden. I was quite surprised. On that basis, I believe his actions were somewhat forced and unnatural throughout the time I was with him. He may have some sort of complex. That's not a nice way of putting that. Has a complex of something or something of that nature. Um. Huh. Actually, can I, like... So I can just do that right here. Uh, is there anything I want to do first? A Persona Awakening. Ah, nice. Oh, the fox is here, too? Uh, Whoa, where hi. Did this guy come from? Dude, it looks scary too. No, he's a, he's a good boy. This apron, I think I've seen it at the shrine before. Yes. Huh? Curious with me. Is it just giving us an item drop? Huh? Cooperate with us? Are you serious? So he wants money in exchange for fixing us up? Slash, is the fox going to join us in the TVs? <laughs> And give us healing for money? That sounds fucking great. What's with this guy? It acts like it understands what we're talking about. It yipped again. Oh my god, if the fox is a is an in dungeon shop, that would be amazing. Like an in an in dungeon inn. But when you think about it, that means the police on duty and whatnot didn't find this fox, right? I guess. If it followed after us, then it really is something. That's not what a yip is. Huh? You think it really understands us? What should we do? Well, I'd feel bad if we tried. Damn it, it's 12.07. I wasn't paying attention to the thing at midnight again. Shit. What do you think? Let's let it help. Yeah. And thinking about what happened at the shrine. Don't you think this curing would be a big help for us? Yes. I, d I did not see any messages for it. I'm sorry. Huh? Are you suggesting we take it into that other world? Hmm. Mm, I guess that might work. It doesn't seem like it's going to leave that easily either. Okay. And I definitely don't want it being all sulky and getting up to mischief in the store. So I don't let the fox do whatever it wants. You should try taking it into the other world. Yes! Oh my god. Uh, I mean, we're going to go talk to Teddy. Let's do yeah, it. Let's go. Yeah, let's go. Oh, don't worry. I I'm bringing this fox into the department store so we can jump into the TV. Okay. Before we, before we do anything, let's do this. Whoop. God damn it. Oh. Hi. Excuse me. Do you have any business here? Yes. Mm, as you can see, my master is currently away. Game, come on. If your errand isn't urgent. I regret to ask that you come back late. No, that won't do. Okay. This room is bound tightly to your fate. Nothing here happens without a reason. There must be meaning in our meeting here alone. Okay. Welcome to the Velvet Room. I am Margaret. Yeah, we've met. I am the one who rules over power. 
invited here after my predecessor's sudden disappearance. Oh. Was, was, uh, did Elizabeth disappear? You may be the first person who has ever been welcomed here by someone other than my master. The Velvet Room is inseparable from the heart of its invited guest. The shape of the room and its residence are selected by my master, based on the number of guests and their destiny. Okay. Shall we chat? Sure. I feel that is what I'm called to do. Oh, we're doing a social link. Okay. Ah, oh, shit. Flying out of the limousine. Hmm. Okay. Intriguing. Recurring meetings, recurring words, by deepening your understanding of one another, your bond strengthened. But sometimes the heart is shaken more by a single action than a thousand words. You understand? Somewhat. Today's meeting might be classified as that single action. I've decided. The strange the strand of fate you follow entangle me within it as well. Yo, girl. Perhaps a new bond will be spun. Yo. There is something I have wanted to know, and you are the first guest I welcomed here. In light of today's meeting with my master absent, hmm. I believe we are both special to one another. Okay. I want to know more about you. First, I think I shall have you show me your rare persona ability. The Imazaki. Show me an Ipon Datara that knows Sukukaja. Okay. I wish. Huh. Everybody back now? Hooray. Uh, Priestess gets points. All right, sweet. So I can only go up to 18. First of all, is that one that was mentioned before is not anywhere in here. Got it. Okay. So... I believe I wanted the bottom Yaxini, which is Jack Frost Fornius. I wanted the bottom Amino Uzume, which I can also do right now. And I wanted the middle one here, which is Jack Frost, which I will need to buy a Jack Frost and a Titan for. But the question is which one I wanted the Jack Frost to apply to and which one I wanted the Titan to apply to. Uh, this one, nullified ice, weak to fire. This one is strong against physical, which is pretty good. Um, uh, was put directly in the. Ew, hmm. And then this one nullifies light, nullifies wind. Not great on strength, but magic and luck are, are pretty high to start with. Three, six, and nine. So 61 total points. 55 total points. 30, 40, 61 here as well. So maybe I make Yaxini and Amino Uzume with what I've got, and then I go buy my two that I need to make... Aramitama. I think it'll be the way that this goes. Because I did fuck up last time by getting rid of the fire resist, which was very, very stupid. Uh, but at least I can buy another Jack Frost that, Frost that will have it, and I can pass that on. Um, yeah. Yeah, okay. Um, there's an Empress one. Oh, yeah. Are any of these priestess? Sarsvati is priestess. They both require Titan. I can always come back afterwards and poke around with that a little bit, but... Alright, we'll start with this. Alright, skills that I want to pass on. Um, ooh, okay. 
So... Ice boost could be nice here. Is there any way to tell which of these are passive and which of them are active? I assume that... Like, are dodge fire and ice boost passive things? Because it seems like infusing other demons to make them strong. Oh, interesting. All right. Uh, I think Bufula is probably a good one, even though there's a decent chance that it's going to learn that on its own anyway. It's nice to just kind of have it now. Dodge is passive. Okay. Uh, is boost also passive, or is that one that has to be cast? Is also passive. Okay. We could do this and this and then. Oh, interesting. So by choosing Ice Boost, you can see that it is something that Yaxini is going to get naturally anyway. It's unclear when it would happen. Bufala is also one that is going to get naturally. So probably shouldn't put those on then. So really what I should do then is... So dodge fire. Ice break might be nice. Having healing is always good. Uh, it's between Ice Break and Skewer. Um, I think I'm just going to do Ice Break. <clears throat> Alright, we're doing it. We're going for it. Shablang! Hi. Our victory lies in your hands. Uh, that's okay. Ding. Cool. All right, let's do another one. Out of curiosity. Does not look like the one that was requested before is in here. So that's fine. I'm going to Uzume. Uh, and I don't want to use uh, Yaxini for it. I'm going to use the Titan one for this. Interesting. It looks like they shuffled them because the Titan one was on the bottom before. But I'm going to do this. Okay, so... I mean, Dodge Ice is nice to have. Takunda is probably going to be a nice one to have, too. Um, Augie. Let's see if any of these are ones that it's going to get on its own. No? Okay. Takunda just seems pretty useful for... Uh, for... Uh, for battle situations. Um, decreasing a foe's attack could be nice, but I think I want to keep some of these. The question is Zio versus Mazio. Mazio is just going to be very expensive. And I feel like if I'm not, if it's not, if it's a situation where everybody's weak to electricity, then Zio multiple times is basically going to be all uh, roughly the same cost. So I think I'm just going to stick with Zio. Let's do it. Blang! Hello! Schwa! Oh! 
Okay, cool. Alright, so now... I'm pretty sure that, yeah, it's not there right now. Oh, Ipon Dita uh, Datara takes an Ame no Uzume. So let's... Uh, with Sukukaja, I think. But let's go back here for a second. Because we have to buy Jack Frost. All right, Persona Shopper. And also a Titan. Yes. But I could buy another Ame. Where did it go? Oh, wait, no, that was... Oh, yeah, do I have to... Oh, no, it's not... Okay, six grand for that. So I can I can buy another one of those in a minute here. Okay, fuse personas. Uh, da, 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 da. Sylph Oribas Amino Uzume for that. Whoops. Sylph Oribas Amino Uzume. Wait, there was one that was Jack Frost and Titan, and it's not here anymore? Shit, I must have used the third one that... Oh, fuck. I'm going to look up the recipe for it real quick, just because I did not notice that I had fucked that bit up there. God, does this one not do a oh, triple? Oh my God, this is so confusing. Titan and Amino Uzume. What? Am I completely insane? Did I misremember what we needed in order to... What the fuck? There's one that's Jack Frost, Omoikane, and Pixie. I don't know what I confused here. Huh. Um. Sylph Oribas Ame. All of these wind up using one of those. Uh, I guess I'll... So I think, yeah, Titan is basically done. I'll buy another Ame, I guess. Huh. Level something up and change the calculation. Did the level ups mess that up? It's kind of odd. Um, it's very, very strange. Uh, but we got a pretty good collection of stuff to pick from for this. Uh, oh, but wait a minute. No, I wanted to do the one with Jack Frost because that way I can keep uh, Resist Fire in the mix. 
That was like specifically the thing I wanted to hang on to. Uh, are any of these ones that it's going to learn naturally? No. I guess I'll do these. Yeah, I guess I'll do this. He angry. Let's get some levels, buddy. Sweet. Takaja. Nice. Gonna learn something at the next level also. Buy another Ame. All the way to the bottom. Oh, I didn't use it, right. It was, uh... Oh, God. There we go. Orbus. Tara. All right. Uh, and it needed Sukukaja, I believe. Does anyone here have Sukukaja? Yes. Uh, who's the one who has growth right now? Growth is coming from... Sylph. Okay. Oh, it's about to get regenerated. I should buy another Sylph after this. Uh. That's Mudo. The Garu, I guess. Ooh, whoops. Alright. Useful skill at this point in the game. Yeah, I, I should start focusing a little bit more on the um on little statusy things as well. Uh he's a creepy boy. Show me your determination. Guess they're doing the whole forest death thing. Okay. Gonna buy a Sylph just because the stuff that's on her I do want to hang on to. I want to get that regenerate, goddammit. Okay, so check on Dwellers. Margaret. The Hermit Arcana, I'm, sh I'm sure, would come in handy with the Sukakaja ability. Sure, its muscles will become stronger as well. I have, I have one. Oh, we have to leave first. Okay, that's a little confusing, but that's fine. Well-rounded, flexible, muscular, splendid. You've done good work here. You are indeed the one with infinite potential. Now I'm even more curious about you. Ah! Sweet. More Empress. Bring me a Matador with the Mahama skill. Interesting. Out of curiosity, do I happen to have anything that would make one? Doesn't look like it. Okay. Um, is there any kind of request with Marie? Huh? Okay, no. Uh, manage rescue requests. Oh, that was the other. Yeah. Yeah. Skill cards. Nope. Uh, 
I think we're good on that. Holy cow. Save. Oh, I had to hit another. Okay. Oh, you found out more about conscience. Yes, we did. Uh huh. A complex. No, oh, that's fair. Um, that's it. That's all I have to go on. Uh. You're working me to the stuffing. You have stuffing. Oh well. Then I'll open my nose up real wide and sniff real hard. Gross. Hmm. Oh, I think I found something. It feels like our target. Is this it? Follow me. Okay. That sure looks right. Hmm. Is it just me, or does the fog here seem kind of different? Like steam? My glasses are fogging up. Yep. And it's hot in here. This place is like a bathhouse. Oh boy. Come here. Pussycat. Oh, such well-defined pecs. There's no need to be scared. Also, all the doors have 201 written on them. Uh... <laughs> now just relax. Wait a sec. I don't want to go. <laughs> She can really hear Teddy? Yes. The nose knows. We're really going in here? Oh, I can already feel the sweat rolling down my back. That's because it's so hot. Yeah, it is. All that's left is to rescue him. Oh, boy. Told you I don't know what that is. Is it tasty? Oh my god. There's a part of me that's tempted to go back to the castle just to give it one sweep to try to get the item, but I think we're just going to move forward for now and we'll see how this goes. Uh, who do I have as my persona up front right now? Uh... Yaxini probably is my best lead right now. Stat-wise, very well-rounded. Got some good stuff in there. <laughs> I do appreciate that all these areas have a different vibe to them. Uh, three, I think everything was more or less the same with, like, light atmospheric differences, but otherwise it was all, like, kind of one deal there. Chill down my fuzzy spine. Thank God a cold. My nose is totally useless, too. Kajukun, where are you? Answer us. Bath number one. Oh, that's cute. That's how they're going to do the levels for this one. Whoop. Go. That didn't count as us getting a boost at the start? Damn. Three enemies. Careful. I don't think I've seen any of these before, so... Uh... Well, you know what? It's worth giving this a quick look here. Okay. So don't use ice on this guy. He'll reflect it. So repel. All right. Try Magaru. All right, so they're weak to it. That's good. 
Alright. Let's try this. Alright. We're just gonna attack one of these. Oh, resist physical. Okay. It got back up. Hurry and beat it. Ooh, God. What was it they were weak to? They were weak to wind. All right. Do I have anybody with Garu right now? You got Garu. You got Garu. Uh, yeah, I'll switch to you. Tardis was a huge hotel with different wallpaper, a few floors. This is a different realms based on who's inside. Oh yeah, no, I like I understand the contextual difference, but I do appreciate that there's more uniqueness to it just from a player standpoint of like enjoying the atmosphere, right? Oh boy. Oh boy. I think I may as well go for the level up. Like this uh, five, there's no way I'm going to get all of them. So I'm just going to go for this. Ka bang. And we get Mamudo for it, which is pretty rad. Agilao, nice. It's also you. This room reminds me a lot of the of some of the rooms from three. Just the general layout of it. Okay, so this one's gonna be a lot more winding than the uh, the castle is. It seems like. Whoops! Shit. Well, all right. All right. So. Did we ever? We never figured out a weakness for this one. Electric, light, or dark. You got Zio. I can also try Mamudo just for the hell of it. That's probably expensive as shit. Let's just do Zio. Three enemies. Let's get through this. And like granted, it also is a fish, so. No, it's not weak to electricity. Alright. And these ones are weak to win. Do this, this, and then an attack. And save a little bit of SP. No. Nope. Dang. You hit its weakness. Let me do it. Sure. Here's our chance. Let's go. Did that just remove it from battle? So I probably didn't get the spoils of that, did I? That's an interesting thing though. Ah, damn. Uh, let's go with money up for now. It did die. Okay. Wasn't sure. That is nice. <laughs> All right. So a door there, door here. There's a hallway. Yeah, let's do this one. Damn. All right. I smell two enemies. Beat them up. Uh, who has Garu? You got Garu. And you got Garu, but you're going to get levels on your own anyway. So let's do you, Ipondotaru. Yeah, it's fine. Does 99-99 damage. Amazing. Spoiler free. <laughs> <laughs> well, ah, uh, man, yeah, the game the game spoiled us, so I guess we're just going to have to start over and pick a new game. Sorry, guys. Come on, I want to get that sweet bonus. Mm. Persona luck up 
would be nice, but also I wouldn't mind another option here. Damn it. You know what? I'll take the half experience on this just to get a sweep started. That's fine. Rakukaja, okay. Oh yeah, there was not a whole lot of experience there to be gained in the first place. Please? Thank you. Oh boy. Well, that's something. Let's try it. Okay. Two enemies left. No. Bribed fuzz. There we go. John is the best. That is what I'm talking about. Three, two, seven, six, seven, and always a critical hit. Jesus Christ, that's amazing. It just does the maximum amount. Well, I guess that's it for our, our sweep. I mean, it's a pretty easy one to do. Level up and experience and a chess key. Yay! Nice, we get Swift Strike. Coming next is Ice Boost. Yay, we're getting that pretty quick. Rank set, oh god. The benefits are so tangible, like fall, yeah, the, the benefits seem to be pretty fucking sweet. So I think, Is this really already starting? I heard the chains. I just showed up. That can't be right. Yeah, exactly. I've opened one chest so far. So why the hell am I hearing the Reaper chains? It's down. Let me handle this. Sure, man. Yosuke strike. It's oh, interesting. I mean, it, it resists physical, but it might just be that it does garbage for damage, but is always crit. Oh, Kyushi. Uh, yeah, let's do it. Another level for me. Sweet. I don't hear chains anymore. Yes, I do. Never mind. I guess I'm just going to go like I would like to look for more chess, but also like, me, but fuck it. You got an S link uh, that doesn't meet on Wednesday to meet on Wednesday. Your copy of the game is clearly cursed. Yeah, right. Death is coming for me right now. I'm, I'm going to die on stream tonight. Apparently. Does that have something to do with kanji -kun? I don't really get it. Do you know what it is, Sensei? I think I get the hints. Yeah. Is there anything you don't know? Uh. All right, don't hear the jangles anymore. There's a glitch in the PS2 version where chains would play if a normal shadow would jump out of a chest in rare case, so maybe that's what's happening. That would be a hell of a glitch to have not caught in time for uh, for this long. Uh, we never
never really learned what the, the deal with these guys is. So, I'm going to try Mamudo. It's going to be expensive, but it's the same cost as two of them, and it gives us two shots to see if darkness works here. No. Okay. Let's beat him up. Uh, do I have anybody with Hama? I do. Titan has Hama. Let's give that a quick shot here. This is both at least PS2 versions of Persona 3 and I think in portable as well. There's a final boss skip. Oh my god. Oh, the thread said it was fixed in golden. Interesting. Okay, finally. There we go. There's nothing in this game that'll repel light or dark, is there? Oh, boy. Oh, more dice. Shit. Two enemies. Hang in there. These are new ones. I forget what the previous ones were all about. I thought it was wind, but I'm going to try... Do it. Let's be free from these nuts. Okay. Nope. Start Tanaka's Tanaka so, uh, social link on December 31st. Just skips to the good ending cutscene. Oh, that's fucking funny. Let's see if it's weak to any of this stuff. Alright. Oh my god. There certainly are, but not at this point. Oh good. Can't wait to run into shit that will one hit kill me because I tried to one hit kill it. Ooh, this is a much more winding one than uh Ooh, yes. Okay. Oh, no, that's SP. Uh. Gotcha. Oh, we got the advantage, too. Nice. A rare monster. So we have not fought Wealth Hand yet. I'm assuming that, they're, that they don't have any real weaknesses, and we just have to beat the shit out of them. One enemy! Fight! 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 Although there is the whole like get more damage out of higher level stuff here. Mm -hmm. Damn you! Ooh, all right. Might do two hits. Automatically jumps to the next day without starting normally, but the next time slot after December 31st is the final cutscene on March 10th. Oh, God. That is super funny. There we go. Boom, baby. Yeah. Fuck yeah. Big spoils, big prizes. Big bucks, no whammies. Well, I can't get all of them with that anyway. Uh, so we're definitely going money up on this one. Oh, Jesus. Yep. Yay! Regenerate! Excellent. Alright. Hey, you got a level two. Hell yeah. I can allow us that much closer. The cutscene before would normally start is traded like a shop. 
She was probably not even thinking about the glitch, but it fixes it anyway. Oh, that's interesting, huh? Um, let's do some. Uh, yeah. There we go. Okay, cool. It is getting noticeably harder right away to fully explore any given floors. Tranquil Buddha. So the power belt is increased strength by two. Tranquil Buddha reduces the chance of panic. I'll wait until we actually run into stuff that starts fucking us up with that first. Okay. There are three enemies. This enemy's weak, weak to, to fire, fire, weak to wind. All right. All right. Three enemies left. Say automatic basalt. You're awesome, Sensei. Go, 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 go. Oh my God! Everyone's going. Oh, autonomic basalt. Sure, man. Sweet. Let's do it. Single hand versus all of you. That's one of the few times Shader's rebelling skill is useful. Crit chance up for everyone, enemies and allies. Ooh, interesting. Okay. Ooh, Saki Matama. Hmm. I'm going to give it a shot. We'll see. Okay. Ooh, boy. That is an interesting call. Ooh, learning many of that quick. Did I have a, a, uh, an Archangel before? I think I did. I had an angel before. I can't remember if I had an archangel before. I have not had Saki Mitama, though. I don't think, anyway. Alright. Okay, so there's the stairs. Whoop. I smell two enemies. Beat them up. I should have double checked that before I switched, but we're good. Okay. Eight. Bing. Good work, Sensei. That's one so far. And you. All right. We won. We sure did. Oh, we didn't get a thing for that? Boo. Physical mirror. Is that exactly what it sounds like? Bear that reflects physical attack one time. It sure is. That could be pretty useful against uh, confounding king or contrarian king or whatever it was. I just got goosebumps. Something is on this floor. Be careful. Something's on all of these floors. Right. It's our turn first. There's three enemies. Well, monopolizing Cupid, daring Gygus. Alright, let's get to it. Mabufu. Oh, I didn't even see what was on the right there. Oh, it's another one of the Cupids. Alright. Okay, but it is weak to that. Alright. I mean, one of them didn't go down, so we'll give it another shot here. Mm. 
Okay, resists there. Sure, let's try it. Okay, missed that one altogether. All right. Turn of floor and Persona game. I managed my goal of beating the Reaper with Mothman as early as possible. I managed it September 15th. Yeesh. Holy cow. That is pretty fucking redonkulous. How did that even wind up working anyway? Okay, no, do not enter yet. All right, let's go for it. I feel a lot less nervous about this now that it's like, okay, but if you die, you can restart the floor. You don't just go back to your last save. Farm knockdowns with theurgy attacks. That's fair. Kanji. Oh my god. Hi. Oh, my, my. Thank you for your undivided attention. At last, I've penetrated the facility. These images are coming to you live from inside this steamy paradise. Okay. But I've yet to have any charming encounters. Could this hot fog be the cause? Oh it's boy. Like steam rising from sweat. Mm, my body's tingling with excitement. Men only, Kanji Tatsumi in Rosy Steam Paradise. Crap, this is so wrong in so many ways. I remember it being kinda like this on Yukiko's show too. A little bit. No, it wasn't like this. In some ways it was. Those voices again. Are they louder this time? Was the manly voice... I'm curious. I didn't think too hard about it before. The manly voice could be a viewer. The manly voice could also be the person who is affecting all of this. It could also be nobody at all. And I didn't... I, I forgot whether it was like a modified voice or not. These voices. I was wondering whose they could be since it's only the victim in here. Is it the people watching outside? Yeah, right. There you go. You mean everybody who's watching the Midnight Channel? They're reacting to the show? Is the Midnight Channel also hypnotizing people? Yikes! If people are watching Kanji Kun now, he's gonna be a legend in a way he never intended. Well, it's really his shadow, not him. But normal people won't know that. The shadows are getting really restless. That elusive thing I truly yearn for. I finally find it here. <laughs> well then, onward and deeper to reach further realms of romance. Let's get going, damn it! Okay. Huh. Kanji kun. That was his other self. It's trying to reveal his hidden feelings. It seems much worse than that time with Yuki chan's shadow. At this rate, it might end up getting bare naked. Ha 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 ha, Teddy. Bare naked? No, Yuki. Oh, man, here it comes. No. Um, was I supposed to laugh? Oh, thank God. Ha ha, fuck you, Teddy. <laughs> uh, uh, sure. I don't know why I disconnected. I'm not like dropping anything there. I was like, my internet connection is still fine, right? And it seems to be, yeah, so. Jesus, that's a lot of these guys. Well, you know what? I can get a Magaru going. All right, I don't have one, but I'm reasonably sure that Yosuke does. There we go, baby. Time to beat them all up. 
Bear Grylls, huh? All right, can we get some good stuff on this one? Only three cards. Hey! So the problem is there's a good chance that this is going to wind up wiping the changed Persona one. Arcana at least usually has a one more card thing on there, so let's see how it goes. Yes, all right, we're good. Oh, perfect, and I can even override the half EXP and get a Persona out of it with a ghoul. Sweet! Yeah! All right, here we go. Nice. This is a door behind me, and we're not quite done here yet. I was expecting this to be similar to the previous one where the floor just kind of stops. But I guess not. Ooh. Oh, boy. Okay, neither of them saw me. Yeah, not great. There are two hey, brother! Zio or Garu would be good to test. Let's try you with Garu. Two enemies. Charge through them. Nope. Oof. Not nice. They are strong against physical. Okay. Let's just focus on this one for now. We'll get one of them down. Nice. I believe doing this game is usually an SMT exclusive demon. Oh, that's interesting. It is? Titan has Zeo. It's the only one I have with Zeo. Please. Nope. All right. Light or dark. Oof. God damn. And heal after the after the battle. It's fine. It's fine. There we go. Ah, oh, shit. Five reinforcements. We're okay, no, this is fine. I got a quick second. I'll heal everybody. All right. Yay, got all five. Sweet. Also in Persona 3, but only fast, not reload or portable. Interesting. I'm trying to remember if I ran into it when I played fast. It was a while back, though, so I would not remember off the top of my head. I'll, I'll grab Fornius. Skill card. And this, what kind of Persona we got? Cool, another Fornius. Thanks, game. Uh, I think Fornius can go. Yeah, goodbye, Fornius. Yay, Yay, you got Rampage. Hell yeah. Excellent. All right. Second lowest level he's ever been. Only time he's been lower is when he was a level you zero okay, demon in Megami Tensei 1. Go. Interesting. All right. Uh, I'll leave it at that for now. Oh, yeah, getting decidedly mazier. Ah, some go homes, nice. Alright. Oh! Interesting. Huh. I don't recall there being any locked doors aside from I guess I guess there might still be a proper 
like mini boss fight that has to be done here. And then that'll unlock, I guess. Or maybe it's or maybe there are certain locked doors that stay locked until you have the person. God damn it. Oh, okay. Didn't react to me at all. Ooh, I don't like how fast that happened. All right, so weak to ice. I'm going to try Hama on Guy, I guess, real quick here. Yes. Good. All right. All right, she is not in there right now. She's never like twice the level and an arcana that doesn't appear often. Oh, interesting. All right. Huzzah. Ooh, five cards. Okay. Uh, if I do this now, then the odds are better that it won't lose this. If it loses that, then it... Oh, actually, yeah, even if I lose that, I'll have enough for everything else. So, so this should be first. Or... Actually, no, because if I do, like, one, two, go one more... Yeah, okay, let's grab the ones that I actually care about first. Now I do this. Yeah, there we go, that's fine. All right, get some money, get some healing. Nice. Right. Curse paper. Cast Mudo on on one enemy. Whoa, all right. It's pretty nice. All right. You gonna start turning? There you go. Oh, I guess it wouldn't have seen me anyway. It's our turn These ones are weak to light. Titan. Three enemies. Let's get through this. Soda. No one stands in sensei's This would be a good time for Mahama, since I don't think usually the Ma ones are triple the cost. And it's a little easier to guarantee the one more doing all three at the same time in case one of them misses. Five. Woof. Oh, well, all right. I guess this is the end of that then. Uh, we're going to do this and this and... I guess this. For skill card one, I don't think I care. All right. Cool. Oh, no, a 50% chance to skill without weaknesses or Mudohama boost. Yeah, they're... I think they're supposed to be a good deal better for that. Ooh, oh, yes. Yeah, there we go. Player advantage and everything. All right, we got two of them. Who's my best strength? Best strength is Titan. All right, then we'll stick with Titan. Oh, who's got my best luck, actually? Best luck is with Aramitama with a little bit less strength. 14 luck. Uh, any crit will immediately... Oh, and it's also... Yeah, let's do, let's do this. Because any crit will basically end the battle. Actually, I would need to do it on both of them, though, wouldn't I? Let's keep aiming for one. Increase 
increases critical rate, one ally. Right. Uh... Yeah. It's also a very cheap, uh... Very cheap one there, too. Jesus. Okay, they're both still here. That's good. God damn it. God damn it. I assume that I can't raise my critical rate more than once, right? You can only do it once. Can only raise stats once. Okay, that's what I thought. Right. Ooh. Oh, thank God. All right. God damn, really? There we go. Oh, that's bad. Sensei, don't give up. Uh, I will have Chie try and. Oh wait, but I have to. I have to revive it, or else we're not going to be able to do a team attack thing, right? Uh. Oh, Hiranya's way overkill. Shit. Uh, it's super overkill, but it's my only anti-panic thing that I've got there right now. Fuck. God damn it. Fuck. Please don't miss. Thank you. Ah, oh, jeez. I cannot afford. Alright. Two enemies left. Do you have something that will There we go. I am now. There. It's different than the Kaja skills. Okay. Fucking hell. God damn it. Piss fuck shit. Ugh. God damn. I could not land a hit to save my fucking life. Oh, interesting. Huh. It's not how I was expecting that to work. Man, can't back down at a time like this. Just watch, and I'll show you how manly Kanji, uh, Kanji Tatsumi can be. Ah, shit. Nice. Hi. It's one. Two and a three. All right, what do we got here? Hmm. Okay. Okay. I've had Sunry before, I'm pretty sure. Uh, let's do 
that. I keep winding up with Titan, like, in my corner at the end of these, which is not what I'm aiming for. Ah, fuck. Let's just go this way for now. Right. Okay. These guys who are also weak to light. Come on back out, Titan. I gotta get Hama on somebody else. Two or three hands, you might as well just run away. Honestly, your base stats just aren't high enough yet. Ugh, I mean... If we weren't having such bad luck on that one, we would have had at least a slightly better chance, but I don't know. I feel like the, the damage that they can do is not usually a huge deal. And it's at least worth a shot just in case. Even getting one of them is a nice big boost to stuff. Uh, five cards. Oh, that's right, it does actually say new. Forgetting that it will do that. Obarion. Okay. Obarion. Uh. Hmm. I th think I've already grabbed Ghoul before, so let's get rid of Ghoul. Shuffle time to max out Izanagi's stats in Yukiko's castle. It's entirely possible and only took 70... Ah, 70 hours of gameplay. Jesus. Although, granted, that's less time than it took me to beat Persona 3 Fest, so... A Volt Suppressor. I assume that's... Yeah, raise evasion to electric attacks. Uh. All right, so Yosuke, got a present for you, buddy. Oh, he's already got a Volt Suppressor. Then never mind, you're good. now uh, a man's a man's got this thing called pride <laughs> I'll never lose oh boy seems getting worse so I can't tell where Kanjikun is at all maybe it's already time for me to retire from being a guide all right ah these are new are they also weak to I think what was it electricity Yes, they are. All right. Nice. All righty. Well, that's rude. If I just take the hit on this one, then at least I now have the sweet bonus. Level 9 are like 35, seeing about 90 Emperor cards and 65-ish of the stat-boosting cards. Jesus Christ. That's fine. Uh, let's do some healing of various sorts real quick here. All right, the dice. There are two we have not win. tried Zeo and physical attacks. Let's try one Zeo. There we go. Here we go. 
All right. Nice. Five cards. Ooh, chariot. All right. Well, I'm going to start with this, this, and please, please hit the, the one on the right. Oh, actually, no. If I do this, then I'm only going to have one more card. I might lose the thing. Because if it turns into an Arcana that doesn't give me more cards, then I'll lose the sweet bonus. Fuck. Let's just let it happen. Let's see what we got here. Yeah, there we go. That worked out nicely. Alright, chest key, some money, and Elagor. Uh Kyushi. Alright, cool. Fuck. Whoa. Nizam Beast. Okay. Two enemies left. Let's see what we got here. Rampage. Well, that's bad. That was cool, Yosuke. Okay. Bufu. Oh, I think I just tried Bufu already. That was stupid. Alright, Agi. Uh, he's got Zeo, so let's do it. Alright. Okay, so none on those. Oh my god. Tigers are here to fuck him up. Take the crit. Gross. It's a lighter dark on it, I guess. Oh, that works. God, it's so loud. Rolling on its back like it wants pets. Yeah, kitty, kitty. Oh, not dead. Okay. Now it's dead. Weird that the ball and chain turns to like a balloon at the end there. Yeah, what do we got for a persona? Kyushi, hilarious. Right, so luck goes up. Kyushi, yes. All right, cool. Uh, poor buddy, buddy boy. sound outside. There are two All right, well, there. let's give Hama a try. At least we're splitting splitting the damage up a little bit here. Right, someone has Mudo. I assume it is Ipon. Yes. That's true. Yeah, that she's also got the healing on there. But it's not weak to dark. It just hit with dark. That's interesting. Ooh, 
Zoop, zoop, zoop. Ding, ding. All right. Do that again. Just get everybody. Uh, I guess Medea was kind of a waste there. I should have just done Dia on herself. That's fine. All right. Here we go. Sweet bonus. And... Ah, damn it. Fine. No luck. Money down. Won't get noticed. And some healing. Sweet. Let's keep moving. All right. Shit, hi. Right, I can't, fuck, I keep forgetting when I get the hermit. I smell oh boy. Don't get careless. Well, that was rude. Uh, you have Mazio. You're the only one. Okay. All right. All right. Have a good one. Catch you later. Thanks for stopping by. I think we're probably going to be wrapping this up pretty shortly. Just kind of want to hit a like checkpoint, and then we'll be we'll be good for tonight. Okay, so we'll start with Lilum. Strength or agility? I mean, strength... Oh, boy, they're both actually really nice. Does agility affect... Agility affects evasion and... Well, agility, I guess, right? Huh? You know, let's leave it up to chance. Okay. Mokoi. Oh boy. Uh Oh, it's too sucky, Mitama. And Mokoi. Getting tough to decide. Turn order and evasion, yeah. Shit. God damn it. Does this meet up? No, it does not. Soul drop, nice. Boom, 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 boom. Hey, steers. There's a chest. Ah, these assholes. Ah, the fucking double fangs. Oh, fuck you! What the fuck, man? Piece of shit. Hit rate is not altered by any stats controlled by your equipment, FYI. Yeah, yep. Crit rate, though, is determined by luck, I think. Right. Ah, damn. One enemy. Fight, Someone else's turn. Yeah. Right. 
This D is nice and cheap. Everybody takes their hit. There we go. Hoi blah. All right, four. We do have a bonus one there. So let's just do ding, ding, and roll a different persona. It's one that I'm not going to be keeping, so. Just key, coin card. And throwing away Saki Matama. All right. Lifestone. All right, cool. Next floor. Party evasion. How likely are to land status effects? And if you get dizzy from physical attack while you were down, or all luck. Ah. Hey there, Kanji staring at us. Hey there, cutie pie. Are you trying to break the barrier of the acceptable, just like me? No, Sensei came to rescue Kanji. Ooh, does that mean you're yearning for me? Is that so? Oh, that makes me so happy. Well, then I simply must prepare something spectacular for you. I'm so looking forward to seeing you soon. Well, toodaloo. This little bear's getting too scared to go on. I just, I'm getting too uh, excited. Are you all right, Yosuke? You're hurt. I guess he's in a little bit of rough shape. There you go. Right. Looks like a job for Mazio. Be really cool if you didn't do that. Be really cool if you didn't do that. There we go. Fuck him up. Your luck effects item drops and chest loot. Ooh, that could be interesting. All right. Anzu. We're definitely getting that. <sighs> Fucking hell. At least we're offsetting some of it, so we're only losing about, uh, uh, like, 30%. Oh boy. Uh Elagor, I guess. Have I gotten a little stronger? You have, probably. I was got Agilao. Hell yeah. And Rakar, I'm coming soon. Smart bomb. What is that? Deals 100 points of non-elemental damage to all enemies. Ooh, nice. Just flat non-elemental damage. Very neat, especially considering I'm pretty sure physical counts as an element. All right. Ooh, this is new. You can attack before them. Okay. No one that. No one that. No one that also. Hey, right, well. Just beat him up. Oh, God damn it. Ooh. Rude. Yeah. You know what? Let's throw that on there for a sec here. 
You already get special effects, like fall up tax, navigator, but yeah, yep, that makes sense. Damn it. Yep. Who do they think they are? I don't know. Someone Some lady sitting on a pyramid. There. I couldn't do it. Whoa. There we go. Shuffle time. Four cards. All right. If I do this, then it could be something bad. Let's risk it. Oh, that paid off phenomenally well. Once again, Titan is getting all the buffs, even though I'm... I mean, now I am completely done raising him. Resist fear. Uh, reduce the chance of being feared, which is great. Kill Rush is good. Dakunda is good. God, all of these are really nice. I guess I can let go of Agi, actually. I got Agi on others. The rest are all too good to be dropping. It'd be some lady sitting on a pyramid that doesn't look comfortable, doesn't even have a back. But yeah, that's her whole, like, she's she's uh, meditating on there, and that's what helps her keep her balance. All right. There it is. It's a mad one. How are we fighting? How more of these guys? Oh, and a little king guy. Alright. On the off chance. Ooh, he absorbs it. All right. Yes, do it. Fuck you, bitch. Very nice. All right, still standing. Piece of shit. Don't absorb it. Yes, perfect. All right. Five cards. All right, Elagor, Chesky. Well, we're not going to get them all, it looks like, so. Uh, it doesn't really matter here, but ah, the sweep comes to an end. Boo. So weak to a wrench in the face. You know, I, I feel it. I feel a kinship with that king. I feel a kingship. Alrighty. Okay. Interesting. All right. I guess it's actually better to do Zio Zio and then Hama. Zio over here. Go, it down. And then Hama right there. Ding. Here we go. Kaboom. Can we get another sweep going? Ooh, not with five cards. It's not likely to happen. Uh, I guess I'm just going to grab this. And Titan is going to get even more boosts. Amazing. Well, it'll be great fodder for fusing, at least. Oh, okay. I thought it was a thing moving. Purifying water, all right. Do, 
do 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 Oh boy. Yep. Okay. Ah, let's just go up. So this floor is really steamy. Hang in there, guys. Okay. So this is not our final one then. Oh shit. Had way too big of a head start on me. Ooh. Okay. A rare monster. Beat the stuffing out of it. What was the deal with this one again? Weak to electricity. All right. Blocking panic might be worth it. <laughs> okay, still standing by. God damn it, man. Fuck you, you prick. Myself here. I'll leave uh, Yukiko to handling healing and such. All right, so it's still sitting still. That's good. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Whoo! Does she have a spell for that right now? I thought she doesn't. Oh shit, my Potter. Yep, she does. Fuck. Uh, well. Please don't change the EXP up. Well, I'm not taking half money for a golden hand, so. <laughs> Goddamn. Holy cow. Might be hard to replace. Yeah, that's true. One big loop. It appears to be. I'm just gonna let that go. We'll just assume it is. Alright. I was gonna say, are we are we here? Because it certainly seemed all of a sudden like they were leaning into that. Uh skill. I think everybody else is more or less fine. Alright, let's do it. Yeah, the music here is great. Whoa! This place is heating up for the sudden entry of a fine young man. Celebrate this encounter. I've provided a special stage. Uh, prepared a special stage tonight. A single match with no time limit. Who will be left standing in the end? Now pour out your hot blood and guts. Oh boy. All right. What enemy ambushed you? 
That's not good. That is a different style from a four. It has 928 hit points. I'm assuming that none of this shit is going to be at all useful here. But fuck it, we'll give a couple shots to things. Yeah, I kind of figured there. Oh, that's bad. Could silence it, but it's probably not going to help me a ton now. But if I can debuff it, then maybe that'll shut it the fuck up for a second here. Fuck, okay. This is going to be rough. Definitely my most enduring one. Let's just stick with it for now. All right. Oh, God. curious how long I can sit here doing spell uh, elemental stuff before he actually does something. Okay, he will... Okay. Well, that's fucking bad. Yosuke's fucking dead. Oh, God. Okay. Crit would go a long way right now. I don't even know if it's worth healing if he's just going to one-hit kill whoever he nails. gonna guard oh boy everybody else can go for attacks while my main guy guards since him dying means we lose we're so close fuck I don't think that I could I, it's, it'd be so close on this it's not worth testing it God damn. Fuck you, game. All right, but now we can get it. Matador had four turns just like your party. Oh, Jesus. Oh, 
Ugh. Well, that was rough. Got a level for it, though. Huzzah! And still got Media, too. Nice. All right. You have. Whoo! I knew you would win. Obtained bathhouse key. Are you all right, Yosuke? You're Interesting. The only locked door that I'm aware of that we had, I guess there's probably a locked door that's further in here. Let's say the only locked door that I was aware of was the one on three, and it just locked one side of the stairs. But not the other side. Oh, didn't see that guy there. Three All right. Zio. Yeah, no, I definitely did get some more revives for sure. The revival beads would be good to stock up on. Sure, go for it. Saves me having to use Hama. Oh. Oops, still up. Mm, kabang. All right, more enemies. All right, same set. We'll do it again. Zap. And Kazap. And it looks like we're using Hama this time. Dang. Should be good answer. All right. We good? We're good. Excelente. Uh, let's do a chess key. Huzzah! Assault dive. Alrighty. Ooh, counter. That's going to be nice. Soul drop. Alright. Just want to get to the end of this floor. And then I think we're going to uh, to turn around from there. What are we fighting? Okay. Mm, Kadoink. I don't think we. It's pretty weak. So I bet. Like not everything has a weakness, right? Ooh, that's not good. Let's do this to give ourselves a little extra boost here. Some things have no weaknesses at all. Yeah, okay. Yeah, buddy. Let's do it. Yes. Definitely like Chie's better, but that's still pretty solid. Yeah, wrench the tiger. All right, no, uh, no shuffle time. Are you all right, Yosuke? He's You're fine. Hurt. He's fine. Huzzah. Ooh, hello. A bead. All right. 
Holy cow. No, no, damn it. That ain't important to a man's man. That's not what I want to become. That ain't it at all. Sensei, the world you came from seems really complicated. Ever since I met you, I really had to think about hard about stuff like what I am. So I kind of understand how Kanji feels. Sensei, we gotta save Kanji. Are you all right, Yosuke? You're okay. Hurt. I think this is going to be where we bail. Because I have. Eh, it wouldn't hurt to. It wouldn't hurt to start from the bottom on the next round. Um, I was gonna say, oh, you know, we can we. Uh, um, Oh, actually, we might be able to just warp up here anyway, so that's fine. Yeah, leave the dungeon. Let's go and do some fusion stuff. Return to the entrance. What's that weird thing with the red apron, huh? Sensei's helper. Amazing. Sensei sure knows some neat people. Nice to meet you, Mr. Fox. Let's both do our best. I'm going to pat its head. Doesn't seem too upset. Oh, Peach Seed. Whoa. Okay, so I assume that it will full heal you for a price, but dang, that's a lot. Oh, that's interesting. Huh. I appended a semicolon to my other message. Did it? Oh, it did. Oh, that's very weird. Huh. Uh, let's see. Oh, that's interesting. You can do it like that. Yeah, that one's better. Yes. Yeah, that one's better. That one is better. That one's definitely better. Now let's fuse some stuff. Oh, actually, before we do that, give skill cards. Alrighty. Yes. And now fuse. What's our forecast? Still priestess. Now we can go up to 22. All right. Oh, boy. All right. We got some good shit here. Um, let's see here. Growth one is just a great one to have in general. Mudo skills are nice off of, off of there. So Ipan Tatar will be good for growth. Uh, some good... Some good extra resistances out of Arumitama. Nothing really coming out of Mokoi. Same thing for Abarion. So resist fear, dodge ice, dodge fire. We're weak to ice, so having dodge ice is going to be important. So I think Titan has to happen here. Ooh, this seems like it's a pretty decent one. Though I might be wasting either Titan or Epon Tatara there. Let's try one that uses Titan. Ooh, this might be a good one. So dodge ice and stuff. Resist fire isn't really necessary since I... Oh, no, that's electric. I nullify electric. I think this is going to be our set right here. Seems so carefree. Yeah, I can vibe with it. Um, let's see. Are any of these ones that are turning up here? No, okay. So there's 2% of max HP each turn in battle. I like that. I like that. Dodge Ice. I don't need Resist Fire, though it is kind of nice to have, but then I'd be missing all the rest of this shit. Uh, mm. 
dodge ice. Let's do dodge ice, and I think I might leave regenerate for now. And I can I can get another sylph for that. Um, Dakaja would be a good one to hang on to. Kill Rush would be really good. Hama, I don't want to like lose entirely. High Pixie's not very strong, but also keeping Kill Rush for as long as I can seems like a good thing in general here. Keep Dia. Alright. Get some stuff. Resist Dizzy. Very nice. What else do we have? 22 and under. Oh, we can do a King Frost. Hey. It's not going to be like an especially amazing one. But it is going to be pretty nice. Not bad on stats, actually. So it's weak to fire and drains ice. So dodge fire is important there. Alertness lowers odds of being taken by surprise. I can't say that I hate that. Uh, let's do Dia and Dakaja. That's all right. Yeah, regenerate two or three seems seems uh, like when it's going to be like definitely worth it. Two percent per turn is like okay, but that's going to be that's like five hit points right now. Uh, actually, probably less, more like four, but still. Uh, all right. Oh, I missed James Games' message. I don't know if you're still here. Have a good one. Uh, I could do a Phoenix with Ipon Datara and McCoy. Might be a slight waste of... You know, weak to ice. Nullifies electricity. But also just having more options for Personas seems like a good idea. Keep Mudo around. This one's going to level up a lot, too. All right. Scraw! Shabang. Should be good for two full levels. I don't think it'll be three. shot. Sweet. Very, very cool. Alright. There's literally nothing else that's even available to us right now. Yeah, how are we looking on the compendium here? Alrighty. Yeah, 16%. Not bad so far. Doing a decent job of climbing up the ranks. 
Nice. All right, I'm going to save. There we go. And I think that's going to be it for tonight. Uh, when we come back next time, I think we're going to leave here for the day. We're still very early in this chapter, so we don't have to, like, overdo it. We can come back in here on another day fresh. I can get some more supplies. Um, yeah, 16%. I, like, I figure the more I try to fuse, so long as I'm not fusing down, like, if I had just have extras that I do not give a shit about and I can use them to fuse down, it's not a big deal. But so long as I'm fusing at least laterally, if not up, as consistently as I can, uh, you know, hopefully we can keep that moving for, uh, for most of the game and get as many as we can. Uh, but yeah, other streams coming up. Uh, I believe tomorrow Dave is planning to finish his Pokemon Y run. Uh, Thursday, I'm going to be back to try to finish my Pokemon Violet game. I am actually going to be trying to do the rest of it all in one go. We're probably going to even be starting early. It might be starting closer to like 6 o'clock, uh, 6 or 7. Uh, Friday is going to be our Patreon hangout for February. Uh, Sunday, I think, is going to be Alien Isolation. Monday, I don't know that anything... Uh, Monday, I'm going to be doing a Mario Party Madness, and I don't think either of the Hook Brothers are going to be around, so that'll be a thing that I should be able to stream. We'll be back for this on Tuesday. Very good likelihood that next Wednesday is going to be the final face-off night for the Brother Lock uh, with audience participation and all of that and, and such. So if that is something that interests you, keep an eye out, uh, and it'll probably be a thing next Wednesday. But I'm going to get out of here. I am I look, I have got the darkest circles under my eyes. I'll catch you guys later. Have a good one. Uh, bye. We all trumpet on the